Oh, oh, they're already here. Oh, they're all friendly mercs. They'll be friendly in all of them then. Oh, this oh. does happen from time to time. We beat the shit out of someone and they decide to join us because reasons. Yeah. <laughs> friendly mercs. Friendly friendly me Sorry about that. What do they bring? Friendly mercs. Here is Hamster. Follow him. Oh he is no, your friend. no. You guys are closest. He is your babysitter for no, the second. No, no, I'm don't, backing don't away. I'm backing away. Let's where see, are they going? Let's see where they go. Oh no, they're going. <laughs> oh. Where they're going? Incredible. No, oh. no, oh. no, no! Oh. Not again! <laughs> Not like this! Not like this! <laughs> right, I'm going this way. No. <laughs> no. Thank you're you fucking. Your you're fucking the, kidding uh, me. They Fuck off! I don't want the responsibility! Leave me alone! Oh, God. <laughs> Great. Good. Superb. Okie dokie. Okay. Alright, uh, so we want to get... Hmm, we'll get that close, actually. Or maybe we could shoot the table. Hang on a minute. We are gonna be we are gonna be so disappointed. Okay, I, I might be able to shoot the table and possibly the floor, apparently. Or maybe I can get rid of the table. Okay. So it turns out that shotguns are infinitely more powerful than AK-47s. Which I suppose kinda makes sense. <laughs> that's destroyed a quarter of the house! Oh, that's amazing! Well, I'm glad you guys talked me into it, because that's actually quite funny. And great- Look at this! <laughs> the giant sea of cargo pods I've left behind! I am not doing responsible wombling! That is not responsible wombling, I've actually left more crap behind than I picked up. I am now the anti-womble. Making good use of the things that we find, leaving all the excess shit floating behind. <laughs> Turning it into a hazard, hazard for all the spaceships. I'm covering the galaxy in huge piles of shit. There you go. Moving on. I wonder how long the microwave liberty. We're not microwaving liberty. No, do not microwave the liberty. Orbital inbound. That's heresy, that Gordon is. Ramsay will hunt you down and eat yeah, your children. Yeah, that, 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 that's Sorry, Tommy. That's what that is. I know. Oh. <laughs> oh my god, we're just barraging everything. This is great. I love it. I think we can call this the word of the day is excessive force. Yeah, no, it's it's just about the right force. <laughs> oh, hang on. Right, ghoulie shots. Oh yeah, look, the ghoulie shots work. You're right. I told you. Yeah, I oh shit, you. I'm out of fucking ammo. Damn it. The ghoulie shots. Ghoulie <laughs> shots. I call them that, but I'll take it. <laughs> ghoulie shots. Behold the ghoulie shots. Super effective. <laughs> Mm, I found my calling. <laughs> I'm hiding well away from you lot. Staying up here. Oh, this isn't. This isn't level the city because it's a new way. Level the city. Very good, my lord. <laughs> oh, no, I was gonna say, you said the words. I don't like how that shell went right over my cockpit. I could have been worse. Could have been through your cockpit. I am aiming way above you. Wait, have I got some further in front? And I saw, I hear like that. And then I see the clouds. It does not feel like that, good sir. <laughs> I am a taller <laughs> man. <laughs> and here we see the Kentaro and the Hunchback having the <laughs> annual argument of fisticuffs <laughs> due to errant artillery shells. Getting into fisticuffs in the natural environment, the densely populated urban area. Uh, I mean, in a, in a sphere, Max. Yes, the natural thing of fisticuffs is a thing. Yep. Really? We we just descend into rock and sock and robots. <laughs> <laughs> hey, fists! No, please reloading. <laughs> I did not notice the Orion were facing the wrong way. Let's hope the other one isn't missiles. Get the angle on me. Oh fuck me! What was that? Holy fuck, what was that? Uh, well, I think the Orion's dead. <sighs> Luckily, they. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, it is I, Hamster of Wrath, back again with a small Stellaris. One of these days I'll learn to look up there, but never mind. Welcome everybody, we have some lovely people in chat already. We have uh, Roachmogul and Shepard. Welcome in, I hope you guys are doing okay. 
Um, yes, we're back with some uh, more stars, which I said already. <laughs> oh, I'm a little under the weather. My ankle is giving me absolute hell at the moment, but this is fine. I'm sat down. I'm okay, not using my ankle, so that's a good thing. Well, I am using it. It's still connected to the end of my leg, but you get the idea. Um, okay, right. Uh, yes, a uh, quick technical um, uh, info dump. Uh, I've gone back to streaming in 720 um, because uh, I've noticed I've been having some big issues trying to stream at 1080 and also my upload speed to the Twitch servers isn't even actually really 1080 viable so we're, we're trying a bit of a, a bit of an experiment he said as he gouges his own eye out um, to see how that goes and uh, yeah we'll see how that pans out so dear god where do we start where do we start at the beginning i guess uh, let's give everyone a bit of an overview here shall we so uh, here we are the ascended hegemony that's that's my uh, hey jimmy the ascended hey jimmy that's me um <laughs> this is me in the galaxy in terrible trouble uh these are the dimian league who we kind of bullied into joining us for reasons probably just because they were taking up a lot of space had something to do with it well, the uh, Tarassian spoilers over here being jackasses, but we sick some mercenaries on them last time, so that was quite funny. We have the Ryogun Coalition, who I think are probably going to get absolutely smooshed. Pretty sure. Fairly soon, because I think they have, like, literally one fleet. So, uh, I'm not going to do it, but somebody else probably will. And going around, we have the uh, newly ascendant Bin Penchan Sovereignty, who apparently have uh, had enough of everyone's shit. And have just started expanding aggressively everywhere. Even though I thought at one point they're going to get absolutely wrecked, but they, they appear to have had a bit of a late resurgence, so uh, that's fun. Uh, we have the Solidarity of Gorthus on the bottom right here, um, who are biding their time, I feel. They're being very quiet. I'm not sure what they're up to. Uh, and unfortunately, yes, we have. Oh, by the way, yes, uh, Solidarity of Gorthus is actually uh, uh, Bamboozle Ballet's custom race. We have the Kiduin Empire, which is unfortunately Reichmogel's custom race. And uh, they're, they're not doing very well. They've got smooshed and smashed and... Oh dear, it's not it's not great. Um, and we have the Ag Aman Enlightened Kingdom here. Uh, I think all of this is like one big... In fact, and the, the, the Kiduin Empire are one big like federation, I think. The Melodic Hub with the Happy Robots, who I think are actually quite sinister, uh, they lost against the Swarthen Empire. And the Swarthen Empire is um, Math's custom race. They're doing okay for themselves. And we have a couple of Fallen races here, and then it's back to us again. Um, so yes, it's absolute fucking chaos. Um, hey Quinlist, hey Sundog, uh, hey Hamster, any plans to play Homeworld 3, by the way? Uh, not right at the moment. Um, I've sort of kept one eye on it, but... I've never actually played any of the previous ones, so um, not not any immediate plans, no. Uh, Swarthens are no chill; they're like Shaolin, follow putter and crack heads. I th I think that sounds about right. Yeah, it sounds about right. It's it's not going well. I think I think you were very much the um, victim of placement here, and I don't think we we're expecting the Bin Penchan to kick off quite so strongly. But uh, they did, so there's that. Right, let's have a quick look at our capitals. I need to learn to slow down a little bit in this game. It's like there is a pause button, and it's important to use it. And I have to remember I'm not in any rush at all. Uh, so we have the Empire Capital. How are we doing here? We're looking pretty good, actually. Uh, nothing major to address here, I think. I've got to move my leg. Ow. That's better. Uh, Shabaria? which is a factory world, despite the fact it only actually having three districts. How do we change the, uh... How do we change that? i got to remember. It's planet designation, isn't it? Is it in decisions? Or is it clicking here? I legit can't remember. No. Cease robot assembly? Didn't even know we had one. Uh, crap. How do we change that? I'm sure there is a way of changing it. Auto des ah, colony designation. Found it. Okay, so that's a factory world. So, industrial district build speed, artisan upkeep minus 20. That doesn't seem particularly useful for this world. Hmm. Uh, 
uh, my empire is failing, but at least my namesake is the Grand Shoveler. <laughs> yeah, it's true. Can you rename factions? Uh, I can't rename other people's factions. Um, I can rename my own. I don't think you can rename other people's factions. That'd be weird. Uh, crikey. What should we put into this? Or what should we change this to? Fortress world? Ruler world? It's not a rural Rural? Woo-woo world? It's a woo-woo world. Uh, I'm going to turn this down, but it's a bit loud. Oh, it's better. When it's districts and buildings, and they thought that factory world was a good option. Hmm. Yeah, Woo Woo World is not an option. Uh, Artisan upkeep, Metallurgist upkeep. Uh, Forge World. Uh, fuck it. I don't know. I'm just pushing buttons, as always. Okay, uh, Whole Home, also a Forge World, uh, which kind of makes sense uh, due to the uh, industrial district there. Talking like Shatner, don't know why. Uh, oh, there's a blocker there, that's good, we can get rid of that. Unpronounceable land. Oh, we can actually build things here. Okay, this is good. Uh, generator world. Not really a generator world, as far as I can see. Uh, also, can't actually move those, so that's kind of awkward. I mean, it's a generator world that has one generator. It's not really. It's not really that expensive, not, not impressive, really, is it? Right, uh, what else can we do with here? Probably some more candy, actually. More industry. Industry? Industry! Uh, what should we build here? We've got a Chathon Monument. Yes, we do. We've got Energy Grid. Yes. Do we have... Hollow Theatres? No. Uh, what else should we whack in here? Oh yeah, we still haven't gotten to the whole mech building stuff yet. We really need to do that, actually to see what they look like, even though, I mean, we're not actually, like, charging at anyone, but I'm tempted. Where actually is this located? It is... Uh, right in the middle. I mean, possibly not the best option if we were going to go invade somebody. Or defend an invasion. Um, might be either useful here... Or over here, perhaps. Um, hmm. Put a light mech bay and put a paladin on some way. Unlock that. I don't know if I did. It's entirely possible I didn't. Uh. Oh, okay. Paladin order is there. Oh, so do you need both of these? I see. I've never used this mod before. So do we need? Do we need both of them? I also forgot to put modded as one of my tags. This is a modded game, by the way, as you can probably tell. Uh, oh, you don't need both of them. Okay, so what's the difference here, then? Paladin Order. Oh, Army Modifier. Defense, Army, Health, Planet Modifier. Housing, Priest Jobs, Paladin Jobs. Interesting. Okay, we're going to whack a mech bay in there. I just want to see what that looks like. Um. Okay, we have Eurus Prime. Eura Prime. Agri world. It's only got three agriculture districts. Again, I feel not really the right designation for that. It's also got a fuming bog, which, you know, everyone likes a fuming bog. Reminds me of the labyrinth. You need to cross the bog of eternal stench. What happens if I fall in? Well, you'll smell bad. Oh, we're out of minerals. I would be building nothing else on account of the fact that I appear to have run out of minerals. Oops. I failed to notice that. That's the other side of the coin. Uh, I need to start building uh, some... Oh, there we go. Automated. That's good. We like automated. And steal all these lovely planets over here, which have mineral production. That sounds like a good idea. Uh, you're going there, which is good. You are building a mining station, which is even better. Right, where do we get to? Uh... Oh, we can't build anything, so it's academic. Never mind. We'll just, they'll just have to live with it, frankly. What did I screw up this time? Everything, PM Collector Boy. I screw up everything. As we all know. It's probably a smaller list of things that I didn't screw up. I started the stream. That, that, I haven't screwed that up. That's good. Uh, um, let's make that bigger. There we go. 
Do you see what's going on? No self depi. <laughs> wow, it's clearly it's clearly a, a a closed subject in PM Collector Boy's mind. He was like, "Have you?" It wasn't "Have you screwed up yet?" It's "What have you screwed up yet?" So I don't think that counts. <laughs> but hello, Baboozle, how's it going? Welcome, welcome. Um, are we not surveying this planet? No, we're not. Why are we not doing that? Uh, ooh, actually, that could do. Oh, that's already being upgraded to a starport. That's glorious because uh, that's going to be a hot point at some point. I had a successful nap. Well, that's good. Excellent. Uh, yes, more minerals. Okay, it does make me laugh when the um, construction ships like overlap each other. It's really quite awkward. Okay, uh, other than that, I think we're mostly all right. Uh, the, all these ships are still upgrading, and weirdly they've all gone to the same place. Which, as you can imagine, has slowed down the upgrade uh, <laughs> queue a smidge, because they've all gone to the same place for some reason. I don't know why. Um, okay. Uh, oh, I clearly must have tinkered with this at some point, because I spent a ton of alloys as well, so that's good. Right, now we hit unpause and see what the hell's happened. Uh, migration treaty. Okay, that, that doesn't affect us. Oh, the Bin Penshan and the Dimian League have gone into a migration treaty. That probably means that they can come to my territory as well, I imagine. Hmm. Interesting. Oh, man, I need to shave at some point as well. Just, just so I wasn't, I wasn't planning on probably doing much streaming after today. Otherwise, I'd, I'd, I'd get even more beardy. More beardy, more problems. Right, wait, what did that say? The Burren Theocracy. Oh, is that the weird little goofy guys down the south? Yeah, that have like one planet. Yeah, okay. And the Galactic Human Tribes, who always get utterly shafted. Uh, They're here somewhere, but they're so small I don't know where they are. <laughs> where are the humans? Uh, that's the Melodics, uh, Ryogans, Burren, Galactic Human Tribes. Sublisword. Sublisword yourself, sir. Oh, literally there. Wow. I had trouble finding them there. They're literally there. I'm going to have a very bad time. Yeah, I, th I think being habitat... Oh, man. Oh, that's better. I think being habitat only might have kind of uh, messed you guys up a little bit, because... Uh, as far as I can tell, like, these, uh, colony, or oh, the habitats here, I think the Bin Penshan have taken the planets, I can't tell because I'm not actually in the, in the situation. So the Bin Penshan have the territory, but you have the habitats, so it's a bit weird. I think they'd actually have to come over here and, oh, that actually looks like exactly what they're about to do. <laughs> oh. Uh, oh no, that's actually, a, that's a friendly fleet for you, actually. Ah, that's where you're going to have a problem. There's a 3,000 strong uh, Bin Penshan fleet uh, sitting on your home planet. So, that's... That's not going to go well there, I feel. Uh, once you that slicing lasers stick out the side irks me. <laughs> I can't remember that one. Was that the guy from Andor? Did he? Is he the one that had the laser, the lightsabers coming out the side of his ship? Because he has some really cool shit, or cool other shit on there. The dropship? Yeah, I can't think. I can't think about which one that would be. Uh, borders closed. Oh no, the small bug people don't like me. Oh, the lat. Oh, okay. Now I was gonna say that that the, the cool custom spaceship in Andor was awesome. I like that. That was good. Oh, okay. Initiating communications. Oh, hello. Research agreement know. proposal. With the Dimian League. No, I need influence. This is costing me too much money. Ah! No, thank you. Not money, influence. Uh, wait, the solidarity, the solidarity of Gorfis want to form a defensive pact? Huh. That's 
Interesting. If either empire is attacked, the other will come to their defense. Why would they want to do that? The trouble is the solitarity of Gorfis is all the way over here. Which I have a sneaking suspicion I can't actually get to them even if I wanted to. No, I actually can't, because I don't think I have closed borders with the Bin Penshan. So I couldn't get there even if I wanted to. <laughs> Uh, I'm gonna have to say no, sorry. Uh, yeah, but again, um, I can't actually get there. Doesn't mean if you end up in your wall, your enemies would be split up. There is that about it. That's actually a fair point. Well, too late. I've, uh, I've turned them down. Uh, you have no orders. Why do you have no orders? Uh, go and do science shit. I, I allow you to do the crazy science shit. Off you go. I'd love to build some more ships. Oh, new ship's fleet have been fully repaired. Good. Why has consumer goods suddenly taken a nosedive? Why do we think that is? Hmm. Non-aggression... A melodic hub has gone into a non-aggression pact with the human tribes. Okay, fine. Uh, yes, having friends is a good thing. I think we're relatively okay with the Golfis. Uh, how are we doing with them? I'll be under S for solidarity. Yeah, we're, we're okay. Oh, their fleet power is pathetic compared to ours. Okay, so it turns out I may well be the only power in the northern bit of the galaxy. I mean, space north. Yeah, this is messy. The these guys are the real threat. The the Agamon Enlightened Kingdom. They they are going to be a problem. Though they're xenophiles, why are they kicking everyone's ass? It's kind of funny. You're so funny. Kicking everybody's ass. Right, why has my consumer goods suddenly gone down? I'm I'm perplexed. Have I broken something? I might have broken something. Don't... Oh, no, it's coming back up again. Oh, that's really weird. Okay. Oh, hello. Archaeological... An archaeological site. Yes. Uh... Ah... Oh, small... On the moon of 0102. That sounds suspect, doesn't it? And the Zevok system. Where's that when it's at home? Dude, where's my excavation site? Uh, wait, that's not even where we are. Oh, wait, are we getting, like... Oh, we must be getting, like, sensor data from the Dimians. Okay, that's kind of weird. The fact the Galactic Center has a wart is somehow bugging me. I think everything appears to be bugging you today, PM Collector Boy, with the sounds of things. Uh, a wart? I'm not quite following. It's kind of... It's because we... we the, whoever has got over here has done a terrible job of uh, uh, surveying the thing, so it doesn't... It's not particularly round. Xenophiles, they hug everyone really, really hard. Yes! And if you were us last time, uh, which were militant xenophiles, uh, we hug everyone and we don't give them a choice in the matter. Which is kind of rude when you think about it. Uh, what's this? Oh, leader level up. Oh! Hello! This is new! Drake, Roach Crusher the Mogul, uh, Grand Shoveler. Okay, so what's he got here? Sector Governor. Oh, here's, here's the go forth and fuck guy. I remember this. He, he, he's the fertility guy. You imagine that being a fertility preacher? It's like, hello, Jeffrey. Welcome to the service. Have you fucked? If not, get on that. It's like, okay. Right, what does this do? Uh, delegate. Very carefully? Okay, okay. Galactic Community Emissary Effects. Uh, Federation Representative Effects. Uh, hmm. Interesting. Industrialist. Specialist pop resource output. 
Uh, pop immunities usage minus 10%. Sector governor effect. Veteran class focused on governor traits. Okay, versus ambassador. Empire effects as counselor. Trust gross. Trust gross. Trust gross. Uh, 5% increase. Uh, hmm. Could be useful. Advisor. Population upkeep minus 5, trade value plus 5. Okay, I'm going to say out of those, advisor looks pretty good. I will say. Uh, what is the Venmo diagram on Cinefos Bisia? <laughs> I'm not even going to go there, PM Collector Boy. I'm, I'm not even going to touch that with a with a 30-foot barge pole. Um, I think it's like, you know, they're not just like... Well, I don't know. Let's face it. If you had the uh, Prophet of Fuck, which is uh, Drake Roach Crusher, and uh, he was a xenophile, could be could be a bit of a legal wrangle, I feel, maybe. Yeah, I like Advisor. Um, and that means he's already a counselor, because he's already, I think, is he a counselor? Yes, he's the Grand Traveler. So if we made him Advisor, that sounds like a good idea. Let's do that. That's entirely new. I, I think, did we actually... This used to happen, but we didn't get a choice in it. Uh, am I remembering that right? So it it they used to level up, but it basically just said, "Here's a trait you've got," and it we you, we'd never actually get a choice in the matter. Oh, it's Paragons that does this. Okay, so I, that was a that was a fairly recent. Uh, I'm sure somebody bought it for me, so thank you. I can't remember who it was. It would have been either Roach Mogul, Bamboozle, or Math. Somebody bought it for me. I thank you very much. Um, but that's cool, because it's like, it, it saves, like, um, oh yeah, Math, Math had a random CD key, didn't he? That was it. Um, you can actually pick traits that make sense, rather than, here, your guy's great at military stuff, even though he's never flown a plane. Uh, spaceship, whatever. Construction complete. Uh, okay, what's that? That's good. Okay, consumer goods is coming back up again slowly, that's fine, don't know what caused that. Anomaly detected. Oh, anomaly. Uh, a wavering signal haunts. Shh, no, that planet. Uh, though it does not seem to originate from the planet's surface. Where is that? Are you still surveying? You are still surveying. Okay, you keep that. You keep that going for now. The pop-up keep Drake got just did that. Oh, okay. Ships upgraded. Oh, okay. Is that ships upgraded? Oh, this is good. This is good. All my ships being upgraded now. Uh, let's have a quick look at those. No, they're still upgrading. They're still upgrading. They're okay. Right, three thousand. Right, I feel we need a representative of our military ass kicking over here. Probably as a good shout. To start with. Who's that emblem that looks like an asparagus? <laughs> looks like an asparagus. I'm gonna be brutally honest here, none of these strike me particularly asparagus-like. Unless you mean the Dimian League. I mean that looks like a string of pearls, but that's another that's another duple entendre waiting to happen. Yeah, that's the Dimian League. Are they pacifists? I think they're pacifists. We, we take them under our wing because largely they work as a good buffer. Uh, hey, Math, how's it going? Or is it a squid? Uh... Oh, this one? The Protectors? That's a Fallen Empire. I mean, that looks a bit like a squid or a crab. I don't know. Everyone's got the wrong flags anyway, because we'll have to figure that out for next time because, um... Uh, I installed a color mod and it jagged up everyone's flags, which is a bit unfortunate. But there we go. Uh, burn to the ground. It's it's okay. Everything's fine. I need a drink. Ugh. It's not so bad. No one seems to believe very strongly in your process. No, I mean, neither do I, to be honest. Locker cleared. Or prowess? No, I've got none of that either. <laughs> No process, no prowess. I just wing it. Construction complete. That's what I do. 
Uh, mining station, that's good. We need more minerals. This is even better. Uh, that's broken. Council agenda available. Oh, hello. Uh, council agenda available. Uh, oh, doesn't matter. Um... Oh yeah, we've got the extra councillor slot. That'd be nice. What position would that be, though, I wonder? Because we've got, like, overall charge, head of research, uh... Was that... <laughs> I actually forget what actual actual thing that is. The Minister of Truth. <laughs> Diplomatic affairs, there we go. That's military, so what the hell is going to be the fifth one? I'm com conflicted. At least they're not the guy who got the wingnut as an emblem. Uh... Wingnut. The Thossian Shard? That's what sort of looks like a wingnut, I suppose. I'm not sure. All the Galactic Human Tribes? One of the two. Unlock a new Civic slot and get related uh, Counselor in the Civic. Up top? Uh, I'm not really seeing anything that looks like a wingnut. Unless you mean that they're spoilers. Oh, we don't give a shit about them, because they're, uh, they're, they're angry. They're angry and we probably need to get rid of them, but uh, I'm, I'm, I'm working on that. <laughs> wingnut. Like Wingman, but Wingnut. I'm still not really generating a huge amount of influence, which is a bit awkward. Oh, hey, 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 things are happening. Oh. Seeds of destruction! Oh god, that sounds like a bag of happiness in my ears. Um, what's going on? Right. What is this? It's been so long ago, I can't remember what it is. Uh... Ah! The alien ship and the intoxicating mist! Can augment the effectiveness and loyalty of our Empire's soldiers. Ah... Sounds legit. <laughs> hey, bird pies! A fox, a hedgehog, a dolphin... And a fungus person walking to the bar. The bouncer stops on the door and says, Sorry guys, we don't have mushroom! Hey! Not bad. That's better than what I was going to come up with. Come up with. I, I, was, I, can't, I can't remember what there's... I think there was a film. I can't remember which one it is. But he was something like, uh, you know... A thing, a thing, and another thing walk into a bar. I forget the punchline, but your mother's a whore. I didn't think that would go over very well if I put that as a, as a stream title. So I decided against that one. <laughs> I can't remember where that's from. I always sticks in my head. I <laughs> can't come up with a punch. I forget the punchline, but you know. Okay, we're gone. Uh, what does this do? Okay, this is the crazy mist. Eldritch. Oh, it's of course it's the Eldritch Oopsie ship. Victory awaits. Our soldiers should be willing to take this risk. Minor artifacts found. Sage rage. Modifier added. Army damage plus five percent. The fact it's called Sage Rage, Sage, the most unassuming of herbs, and probably least angry of the herb family, usually doesn't get mapped, so the fact it's called Sage Rage is quite funny. I'm sure there'll probably be unknown consequences down the line, but that's interesting. Uh, forsake the dangerous technology. There are some secrets not meant to know, uh, 30 relics and 100 influence. I'm sorely tempted to go with the Sage Rage. Because then we're going to be... Psionic... Exoskeletal... Fungal... Priest... Slightly militant hedgehogs. That's a lot of descriptors. You can't see my hands. A lot of descriptors. Uh, people used to think... Pound cake was called that because of Pound of Greens. Pound down where your mother lives. Giggity! Everyone uses, and nobody knows what the flavour is. Yeah, it's kind of a, it's kind of a, it, it is quite a neutral flavour. I think it usually goes on lamb. Sage and thyme usually goes on lamb. Okay, fuck it. I want sage rage. Let's do it. Uh, bliss outbreak. Oh no, wait. That's what happened. Sorry. That's that's the that was the previous thing. Sage rage modifier. Okay, where do I find this? Uh, is it in? Where, where do all the modifiers get listed? Is it like Empire? Yeah, here we are. Which is that's, that's what it is. Sage Rage, army damage plus five. Oh, that's so fucking funny. 
void loops? Oh, physics research. Okay, cool. So, uh, great. We're now powered by herbs. Um, and mechs, apparently. I'm sure nothing bad will come of this, and there will be no downsides at all. Like nerd rage from Fallout? Yeah, that's true. But less, uh, what's the word? Um, when, uh... Ships upgraded. We have two words that, like, like, uh, oh, what do they call it? I like when, um... Oh, the guy who was in charge of Marvel Comics, he made all of his names similar. So you had Bruce Banner. Is it alliterative? No, 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 not oxymoron. Um, alliterative names, so he wouldn't forget them. So you had Bruce Banner, Reed Richards, uh, Susan Storm. So, so he he never he always made the the the, the first name, and the second name, be alliterative, so he didn't forget them, which has always stuck in my head. So Sage Rage, even though it, that, it, it would have to be complete. Sage something else that began with an S, so it's not alliterative at all. Complete. Fuck yeah, I just like the sound of Sage Rage. It sounds funny. Anthony Stark? Yeah, ah, no, that's the thing. He didn't... Uh, hey, Tanker, how's it going? Sage Rage rhymes. There you go. Yes, but uh, Captain America and Iron Man were later on down the line, whereas the Fantastic Four were, were kind of earlier on. But welcome, Tanker. I hope you're doing well. No, we have... Uh, we found some magical mist on a spaceship, and uh, I've now given it to my soldiers, and it makes them angry. So we're going to be uh, herb-powered hedgehogs in Mecca fairly soon, which uh, will be really funny. Have we actually built that yet? I want to find out. I think we only literally just set it going. Also, I can't remember where I actually built it. Where was I building it? One of these ones was building it. Ah, oh, there we go. Unpronounceable. There we go. Oh, no, it's going to take forever because I'm building the districts first. I do that. Yippee meth! Yes. Canopus, Canopus Battle Powder, whatever you want to call it, yep. Senate is now in session. Okay, what we got? Comfort the Fallen. Diplomatic weight from tech. But, uh, oh, everyone! Okay, I know. I see what's going on here. So I oppose this. Uh, wait, I've been humiliated? What the fuck? Diplomatic weight minus 25 because I've been humiliated. Why have I been humiliated? What? Monthly influ- Oh no wonder my influence is fucked! You were publicly humiliated by another empire. No wonder my fucking influence is boned. Okay, when did that happen? And why did that happen? That's interesting. Do I sleep through a meeting? <laughs> yeah, probably. No, I haven't fought anybody. That's so weird. I've got no idea how that came about. And it's gonna last for three years. Great, no wonder I've got no fucking influence. Jesus Christ. Okay, right, what we got here? Algrid Forge Brewer. Brewer, even. Uh, Ayatollah of Digging Holler, who is rubbish in a fleet, but pretty good in other ways. Um. Ooh, okay, we'll go here. This is so annoying because she made a. Uh, uh, they. It. They make military fleets really crap. That's like armor hit points minus 10% and shield hit points minus 10%. If that wasn't there, one of these would be great, but. Uh, okay. Military fleet effects. Uh, ship weapons damage, ship fire rate. I mean, that could make a bunch of glass cannons, I suppose. Damage versus star bases, orbital bombardment damage, army effects. That's nice. You must have chosen a dialogue option to avoid war, which did it. Really? Huh. I can't remember when that was. I don't remember. I don't remember anyone saying, "Come and have a go if you think it hard enough." For me turning it down. Ah. I legit don't know when that was. 
should be the ruler title after they pass? It is. It, it's already... That's the... Oh, no, you're right. We were going to... No, it is the title. That's what it's called. <laughs> the, the military... The military uh, leadership is called the Ayatollah of Diggenhola. Yeah. Uh, governor effects. Soldier jobs and stability from soldier jobs. Okay, interesting. And strategist. Military ship build speed. Ooh, I'm torn between... Well, I'm unlikely to going to put this person in charge of a fleet. Because they make the ships they're in crap. So I'm wondering if maybe I would just do, like, strategist, which makes my ships build faster. I'm going to go with that. Humiliation is a huge negative that shouldn't have been able to sneak through. I legit don't know where it came from. I, I legit do not remember. Yeah, it's never going to get in a spaceship ever again. It is. It is bad. And that is why we've only really got... Effectively... Uh, where are we? I've got four commanders, but technically I've only got three. Because uh, I'm not put putting this person in a fleet. I mean, arguably, I should probably replace them. Um, with literally anyone else. But I think it was because they're... They've got uh, Hostility and Enlister. So their ship weapons go zoot zoot better. And a Sector Governor's not really... Doesn't really count. But yeah, the rest of it was... Yeah. I think three will be okay. <laughs> Right, speaking of which, did they all actually finish upgrading? No, that one hasn't. Uh, that one has. Oh, wow, okay, yeah, these upgrades are uh, actually making a pretty big difference. Okay, you're on the move, aren't you? You were going somewhere. Oh, no. Moving to the Shefala system. Oh, you are there, but for some reason it's not showing me the, the path you're taking. Oh, okay, that's fine. Right, the quick response force. Okay, I think we need to put them... I don't really know where to put them, to be honest. Uh... See, this looks terrifying, but these are all the mercenary lot, so I don't think I have to worry about them right now. Uh, if anything kicks off, one fleet is not going to make a difference down here. I don't know, maybe I should just leave them in the middle of the, uh, sort of like... I might just leave them... Actually, wait, are they next to a station? They are. They're probably good where they are, because basically if anything happens inside the interior, they can go out and have a word with it. So, that might be a good idea. Uh, these are all upgrading still. This is fine. Construction complete. Uh, what's that? Starbase? Okay, yep. Uh, have we got enough? Oh, wow, our alloys have suddenly gone through the roof. This is good. I mean, I still don't know where consumer goods are going down, but that's fine. Right, so I think we're going to use this as a bit of a choke point, I think. Uh, yeah, we can build a couple of these. Have we actually upgraded these at any point? I can't remember. We might have done. I'll have to have a look. May the galaxy be the new sea for the small fins. Yeah, you're you're doing okay, honestly, Math. You're, you're doing much better than poor old Roach Muggles lot is doing. Thank you for the uh, hydrate. Yeah, actually, honestly, you you guys really need to get me on the whole posture check thing. I was, I was watching the VOD back of uh, uh, Dark Tide yesterday, and I noticed that most of the time I'm actually listing. I'm like this. I, I think it's because I'm like I'm pushing with my with my right with a with a mouse hand, and it's just like I, I I was I was kind of over like this, and I didn't really realize what I was doing. Or was over like that? I can't remember. Either way, uh, for empires to use by AI, the simpler the better. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah, we were saying, I think, I think possibly, um... <laughs> painted hamster lean. Yeah, painted chiropractor's bit, if I'm not careful. Uh, mind you, I feel a bit like that already. 
Um, I think the the reliance on the habitats might have slightly slightly messed up. Uh, I mean, I'm guessing because I've literally this is only the second time I've actually created my own empire. Well, you guys helped me create it anyway, so technically this is I've only actually created one empire, so I have no idea what is a good or bad option to be honest. It's just waiting for the hammer to fall. It's yelling at me saying people are idle, but I think that's a lie. Oh, hello. Uh, wait, one? Reversing deep scan polarities. My cat hates when I play Dark Tide. <laughs> Wiggling with the dodges. Yeah, I used to. I actually. <laughs> I, I used to know a couple of people when we actually, um, yeah, used to play things. I, I used to have used to have people like, like 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 do this, and it's like that that's not going to help with with the dodging at, at all. And then my other personal favorite, I've got my hands in shot here, is somebody holding a controller and then going like. And this was before the, you had any of the sort of like uh, mercury switches or whatever it is in the in the in the in the controllers. That doing this did nothing. Um, it's kind of funny. But anyway, like I say, I can't say much because, like I said, I was, I was, I was playing Dark Tide like this. So, I, I can't say much. Okay, so this was the planet I accidentally uh, melted and we brought life back to it. So, that's good. Unless, of course, the life now wants to kill us, which is also entirely possible. Uh, society research lots. Added plus six society research to Endulia. Isn't there, isn't there a pepper called an Endulia? Or is that an Endulia? No, that's a sausage. It's a really weird sausage. It's like a non-Newtonian sausage. It's neither solid nor liquid. It's very odd. Fantastic news! Um, yay, go us. Um, oh wow, there's a lot, there's a lot to be done. In, in here, good god. Uh, I'm gonna put you on like full spectrum research shit, and why are you going down there immediately? Why? Why? What? Why? Why? Okay, it's prioritizing. It's prioritizing archaeology? That's fucking bizarre. Okay, let's not do that. The mighty Tassagoid. Oh, this is the capturing the, the the alien thing, isn't it? Okay. I know the feeling. What? Hmm? Huh? Fucking autocorrect? I, I don't know. Habitats only... Or the location, the caliber of the neighbors. Yes! It's like I said. The funny the funny thing about it is, is that if you look at it, uh, me and the uh, Kyriod Empire... We actually started in roughly the same place, like, relative to the core, only on the opposite side. I mean, I expanded relatively quick, and it looks like you guys just got bum-rushed by the uh, Enlightened Kingdom. Which no one wants to be bum-rushed by the Enlightened Kingdom. That is true. That is a good point, actually. I suppose it probably... Does it, does it take longer to build a habitat than it does colonize a planet? I suppose that kind of makes sense. I'm still perplexed as to why we were humiliated. I don't remember us being humiliated. I think I would have remembered. <laughs> it's like... Uh? Humiliated? What? So weird. Nobody expects the bum rocks like Inquisition. They they very much do not, no. Right, you're... Oh, you're, you're finished here. Okay, that's good. Um, Go over here and discover more weird and horrendous things. That'll be glorious. Uh, covered where the overlord is now. They got eaten up by them in the south. Survey complete. That's what I think happened. Also, I don't know where the hell the <laughs> these weird motherfuckers came from. Um, whether they were like, oh, they're fanatic xenophobes. Okay, no wonder people kick their ass. Okay. So you've got a you've got a, a bunch of xenophobes in your backyard as well. So why, how these guys are still alive, I don't know. Wait, did they did, did they bring them part of the did they make them part of the federation? 
Oh no, they had a. Tr oh. I think I see what happened. Uh, the little squiggly dudes went to war with the uh, giant empire and got their shit handed to them. That 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 makes sense. So yeah, it's this. It's not a good day to be a be a, a an empire in this part of space. Some people may pay good money to be bum rushed by the Enlightened Kingdom. You're right. That's entirely possible. Oh my word. Got devoured by a stronger military? Yep, quite possibly. The trouble is... Spaceborne life form. Encountered. Uh, some of this is kind of like secondhand my fault. Because the uh, Terassians were beating up the Bin Penshan. And then I hired these guys to have a go at the Terassians. Which then weakened the Terassians. And then the Bin Penshan had a massive surge. And they've just gone whoop. And it's... Yeah. Secondhand, my fault, really. If such a thing is 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 uh, possible in intergalactic politics, right? Have we okay? We've claimed that system. Can we get there? Do I have a spare dude? What are you doing? You're building a mining system in the what? Oh, there? No, go build a star base here. Because then that can be our that could be our primary doorstop, even though I've kind of well secondary doorstop, even though I've just upgraded that station. I think. Never mind. It's fine. It's perfectly fine. Okay, I'm trying. To, I'm trying to pace myself mentally a little bit, which is why I'm stopping and chatting with you guys for a bit more often. Because last time I was just kind of like blah 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 blah, blah and it was like I got to an hour in and my brain was just like out my ears. It's not good. Uh, two Marauders and got Raider. Didn't have the infrastructure of a large fleet. Yeah, I think, uh, the only reason I, um, pers that, like, persisted in the my first playthrough was because it was on whatever the lowest difficulty is. I think this is, like, the second easiest dis difficulty. I can't remember. And what did we have? Was it, like, three... Was it three, uh... What do we call them? Three purifier races? I think it was three. Like, not very far away from us, and uh, we did okay. I, I think if that had been a slightly higher difficulty, I would have got my ass handed to me. So, um, yeah. And also, bearing in mind, like, when we were playing Season 1, I got a massive amount of advice from everybody, because I didn't know what the fuck I was doing, so... I only vaguely know what I'm doing now. Ships upgraded. Oh, okay. Uh, the... Tra oh, rivalry ended. Okay. Don't know, don't know why. Oh, is it because the Terrassian despoilers are probably terrified of getting beaten up, probably. Wait, who's this? Unidentified Empire? We've still got one... I'm spitting a lot today. I hope it's not showing up on the camera. This is disgusting. I hope that's not... Uh, that's weird. So there's one more empire we don't know about, because that says unidentified. I mean, unless it's a space weirdo. Yeah, it could be space crews. Because there's not enough room for anyone else on here, is there? Especially up here. Yeah, yeah, that's it. Yeah, every, every time I see unidentified empire, I think it's a, I think it's a, a thing. The other marauders are a pre-FTL. That would be annoying, wouldn't it? We're gonna go marauding. We can't. Why? We haven't invented spaceships yet. Uh. <laughs> oh, Azakian raiders withdraw. Oh, uh, the raiding fleet that the Azathian sent the Terrassian despoilers after we encouraged them to do so a set of court back to the home system. Um, captured. Oh, slaves. Oh dear. Oh, I didn't. Um. I didn't realise that the Azathians would enslave people. That's, um... Well, that's a bit unfortunate, isn't it? Never mind. A job well done. Hmm. Oh, wow, so they have really been... Hold on a minute, then. So these guys must have been absolutely beating the crap out of these guys. What state are they in now? They are marauders, that is true. Um, what are we looking at? T for Terrassians. Fleet power is pathetic. Yeah. 
If I was in a slightly better situation, I could definitely go and kick their asses. Oh, they're already in a war. Oh, they are at war with the Bimpenshan. Okay, so the Bimpenshan are probably going to kick their asses for me. That works. I mean, either way. That's not so bad. Still running a bit low on consumer goods, though. A little worried about that. Everything else is looking relatively healthy. I also need to spend some of these because at the moment we're at max uh, thing of them. What's a good use here? What's museum exhibits? Put minor artifacts on public display to inspire our people with the wonders of the past. This action must be performed as a decision on a planet. Interesting. Never actually did that yet. <laughs> Pathetic Xenos. I mean, we're all Xenos, really, aren't we? Every everyone's an alien to everyone else. It belongs in a museum. I can't do I can't do a Harrison Ford impression. I wouldn't even dare. Uh, celebrating diversity, xenophile ethics attraction. Uh, religious revelation. That sounds fun. More unity. Fuck it. We might as well use these things. We're just burning them otherwise. God, my, my empire is only slightly less schizophrenic than it was last time around. Yeah, so let's let's do it. Let's do a little checklist here. Uh, holy! Wait, hang on. Egalitarian, militarist, holy hedgehogs, with access to exoskeletons, light mechs, sage rage. I've forgotten something somewhere, but yeah, we're we're a, we're a we're a fucking strange lot. God, no wonder I was having trouble with my heap. I wonder, I, I, that's bugging me. I don't know how we got humiliated. I am perplexed as to how that came about. Both of those on a loop for unity. Yeah, that that sounds like a good idea actually. What's this? Uh, trade treaty has timed out. Good, we might get some of our influence back. That's fine. Thank you for the stretch math. Did I do that already? I don't know. I can't get away with it now. I can't say, yeah, I've totally stretched, because now you guys can see me... Yeah, the, you guys can see me on the uh, <laughs> screen now. Terrible Envoy event? Yeah, maybe. It, let's put it this way. It wasn't... It wasn't notable enough uh, for it to register. I mean, I know I'm a bit of a scatterbrain, but it, it just did not register as an actual, like, thing that happened. So I, I legit don't know what happened. Science ship RLS Fathometer. Oh, the Swarfen Empire. Oh, hello. Uh, let's, uh, let's, let's research that normally before you do, I. Also, we need to actually steal that sit ship before you get there, either. I think I'm going to get there before them. Yes! Good! Otherwise, having a dolphin blob there would have been very awkward. Were you part of a war defending an ally and they peaced out? Oh, that might be it! I wonder if it was something to do with the Dimian League or something daft. Maybe, maybe, like... They pulled out of something when we... Yeah, that could have been it, actually. That makes way more sense. Yeah, we, we it could have been just the timing of it. Yep. I'm gesturing my hands, but you can't really see them. There you go. Hands. Timing. Right. Uh, okay. Strange door. Doors in space. Ugh. Uh, a vast and time-worn door is revealed. Is it blue? Does it say police box on it? Open the door! Minor artifacts found. Ten. Well, that's a bit of an anticlimax, but okay, sure. <laughs> ah, yes, the, the Naruto hand... hand... Fox Ninja. You know, I don't know what the fuck. Twilight Zone door, yeah. The Dimian League has now declared the Terrasian to spoil as their rivals. That's brave! I mean... Oh, fucking hell, what the hell's this? 
Oh, that's the Azathian Raiders. Oh. They went very far into uh, uh, Tarassian space. That's that's quite funny. That was a good shout, though. Wait, I have a sleepy construction ship. There's always something to do. Why are you sleepy? Build stuff. Why? Oh. I, that, that wasn't highlighted. I was going to say, take, take that stuff. God damn it. Tassagoid secured. Um, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. This is the whole uh, alien uh, uh, reclamation nonsense. May you be a river. <laughs> I, I get that was coming from a from a place of kindness, but uh, uh, sure. <laughs> be me a river. That's, uh, yeah, never mind. Um... Okay, uh, good. It's, it's horrible, and now we have one. Oh, three of the crew members were eaten. Oh, dear. We'll name one of its wings after the brave, honor, uh, 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 bleh, brave officers to honor their sacrifice. I mean, uh, excellent. I don't think excellent is really the right turn of phrase, is it? Some of my crew got eaten. Excellent, Smithers. No, it's good, actually. Honestly, me, the, the, the way my motor mouth goes, uh, regular hydration is, is good. I'm already, like, most of the way down my glass already. I used to... I kid, I kid you not, back in the very early days of streaming, I actually had, like, primary drink, which was a glass. I actually had, like, a weird little thermos, which was, like... Secondary drink? <laughs> I don't quite think I got to tertiary drink, but yeah. Space hedgehogs taste good. Yeah. Well, luckily I I, I headed you off at the pass there. Uh math. Cause you were about to nick this planet, which would have been really awkward, so I've nicked it first. Less than one popper's material. <laughs> That's true. Less less than a million, we're not interested. Uh, the Ransomers. The Ransomers. Ransomers? Emergency Boy. Boy, boy. Okay, it's... It's... It's word time. Is it word entomology? I, I, is that the right use of words? I don't know. Uh, boy or buoy? I bet you will, I, I bet the Americans in my audience probably say buoy. I look at that and I say boy. Emergency boy. Hi, I'm the emergency boy. Uh, okay. I mean, the fact it's called Ransom Ears, I'm slightly worried about. Uh, emergency transmission boy. Uh, Seemingly like glancing weapons fire. It might be a Hegeite, Hegeonite model for civilian ships. It has a weak, distorted signal. Emergency boy is just a paramedic. Yeah. Just to pronounce boy? Yeah, that's what I figured. Yeah. I, th I think in this country we call it boy, and I, I, I keep hearing... Like when you see like like movies and stuff, they call it they call it buoy. Yeah, boyardee. It's chef boyardee. That's what it is. Okay. Um. All right. Clean up transmission. Issues special project emergency buoy. That's a trap. Leave it be. Uh. Fuck it. Let's clean up the transmission. Log updated. Why not? And that's because I actually now have to research it, which I have... Oh my god, I've got so much stuff in here. I've got so much. Oh, finishes in 30 days? Fuck it, go. Great, this is where we get hacked. We get hacked by the mighty space lizards. Uh, what's this yelling at me about now? Um... Buzzword standardization. Okay, no, wait, I think... Is there a new one in here? Oh, here we go. Ban organic slave trade. Uh, yes. I'm... 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 I'm supporting that, which I have a funny feeling most of the people are not going to support that. Because <laughs> they're weirdos. I... I'm so... I'm sorry, I still have to laugh that the uh, home system of the Egg Aman Enlightened Kingdom is literally called Fucked. I'm sure if we were we were kind of like to, to get on our high horses, we could argue that it's pronounced Fucked. But to me, it will always be Fucked. Shh. 
ships upgraded. Okay, and now is that is all my ships upgraded now? Are they still going? Oh, you're still going. Right, this is literally called new ships. Why is it called new ships? Let's let's call it something literally other than new ships. How's that? We'll call it. Have we already got an anvil fleet? We haven't got an anvil fleet. Let's call it anvil fleet. There you go. That's fucked up. Exactly. And they massacred my boy. Yeah, they're fucked. <laughs> um. Okay. So yeah. Okay. My um. Yeah, my ship's pretty hunky dory now. Actually. What are you guys doing? Uh, you just sat there? Oh yeah, you're at home home base. Okay, so what have we got there? Uh, Notorious Third Fleet. Where do we think trouble will strike at us from? Probably not up here. I might put another fleet here, because I think if something kicks off down here, it's gonna be bloody fast. Um, which worries me slightly. So really, these guys should be here because they can respond a little quicker then. That makes sense to me. And the amount of uh, people per pop is not linear, so one pop does not really... Oh, I thought it was... A... So, when we had that event when uh, the, 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 the rogue scientist went, like, proper rogue, and it said you've lost one pop. I thought that was like a million or a bit. Is, is it a million or a billion? I don't know. When they said one pop, I thought that's not so bad. And then somebody came back and said, you do realize that's like a, a billion people. I'm like, oh, that's very bad. Oh, hello. The ransom is SOS. The boy has been verified as one of Hegeonite make. Why is there a space after Hegeonite? Who knows? And the signal is relaying has been stabilized. Wait, have we got like weird cousins? Hegeonite authorities, identify yourselves. No video feed. Hello, this is the captain of the Luxian, a Hegeonite civilian transport. Uh, former captain. The Luxian is gone. We were boarded by pirates taken captive before they blew up the ship. Who captured you? They call themselves the Ransomers. At any rate, they're a vile bunch. We'd be dead already if they didn't think they could get something from us from the Ascendant Hegemony. I've overheard them discussing their demands. We will not rescue you. The event Hegeonite Captives happens. We will rescue you. The event Hegeonite Captives happens. Okay. I mean, this sounds like a trap. Uh, but, you know. Held in some space station. Have no idea where we are beyond that. I will increase the transmission burst now. It should let you triangulate the location of this prison from the emergency boy. Position recorded in the situation log. Log updated. Huh? Massy's happenings? Uh, ransom is. Band of pirates comes to the rest of the We intend to free them before the pirates make any demands. But where? Where? Oh, ransom here base. Made a home out of an abandoned mining station. Where's that? Oh, hello. Interesting. Well, we can go beat the brakes out off them. Time to get a pummeling by Anvil Fleet. Oh, yeah, baby. Uh, yeah, no, we can handle that. All right, let's make sure they're set to uh, aggressive. Time for bye-byes. Oh, I should probably put a commander in charge of that. That would well actually no, that should be fine. That's a tiny fleet. Uh interesting. Where are the O captives? Yeah, 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 definitely. Uh in fact, what I think is 
probably happening. Uh, no, right, Super Clanker doesn't have one. He's going to Rimbolf. They're upgrading. What does he do? Ship hull points, uh, ship weapons range. Okay, let's put Key's Locksmither in charge of this lot. I think that's a good idea. Actually, Key's Locksmither as a rescue uh, option. That sounds great. Let's do that. Let's, let's re- uh... He's not really using keys to break the doors down. He's using guns. Interesting! Haven't seen that one pop up before. That's uh, interesting stuff. Commander Keys to the rescue, exactly. Construction complete. Uh, Starbase, good, good, good. What's Construction that? complete. Ah, yes, there we go. How many Starbase is going to have? Two more before it starts burning through resources. All right, get out of my... Get out of my territory, Swalfins. Have we closed our borders to the Swalfins? I feel we probably should. Let's have a look. I don't want them nicking my stuff. No, we haven't. I should probably get on that. I, I, I don't have anything against you personally. I just don't want... How much is that going to ping our... Uh... Uh, friendship meter. Probably not a huge amount. That's fine. We can handle that. Because this is this is a mistake I made last time, where we just had people randomly going through our territory and just nicking stuff. Which was, uh, awkward. Yes, I just booted you out of my, uh, my territory. Yep, that's fine. That works as far as I'm concerned, because the funny thing about that is, is that you've got two fallen empires between me and you, so... <laughs> oh, funny. Providing nobody... Oh, nobody can take that system. Actually, providing the Swalfins don't get that system before I rescue my dudes, actually, that'd be very bad. Uh, the Bin Pension have made peace the Tarassian to spoilers? <laughs> That's amazing! So, the, uh, the spoilers who are like, boo, piss, murder everyone, they've made peace with the Bin Pension. Probably because we set those mercenaries up there to beat the brakes off them, so, uh... Oh! Oh dear! Yes, look at that! Yeah, these, these guys aren't gonna be a problem now. It's interesting, the Bin, the Bin Penshan have uh, become a little bit of a dark horse um, in as much as I don't know if they're going to be a problem sooner rather than later, so uh, that's, that's going to be interesting. Interesting. Uh, was that the proxy rule with the Kirun? Uh, no, that was that was peace between the Despoilers and the, and the Bin Penshan. I don't know... Nope, they're still at war. Um, they... Yeah, it said something about losing, um, systems, but the fact that they've got... They, they've got more of the map than they had a minute ago doesn't appear to have slowed them down. Oh, hello. Leader retired. Oh. Well, that's, that's a new one. Commander Riker Spikechucker served the Empire for 40 years, retired after being infected by an alien organism. I wonder if these... Is this, like, one of the uh, DLC things? They make people's retirements sound far more exciting than they got old and fell over? Um, because I appreciate that, if so. Um... Right, we need a new commander. What have we got here? Recruitable leaders external. Oh. I read that quick and I thought that said communist ORAC. I'm like, nope. Riker got a space STI. It's entirely possible, yes. 
Either that or he lied on his report card and uh, he tried to do the Riker mover over a chair and he just like uh, injured himself. Um, so what do you do? Ship fire rate plus five and you're a, what are you? You're a Dimian? Okay, interesting. Uh, ship weapons range plus 15 and you're a Bin Pencher. Interesting. Ship weapons range. Ship hull points. Uh, naval cap. That doesn't really help ships. Defense platform. Okay, I guess it's one of these guys then. Um, not much to be said between the two, to be honest. Ship fire rate's nice though. And they're militarists! They'll fit right in! Yeah, let's have that. Mind if I do. Um. Oh, okay, that's quite cool. Nanunzast Orak is a militarist commander from the Savannah world of Dimes, Dimes, where she previously held the position of ship weapons officer. Makes sense. Right, now I need to find out which goddamn fleet she was driving, because uh, it'll be one that doesn't have one. Oh, following the fungi. Right, hang on. Complete. <laughs> Hold on, game. That's what the pause button's for. Um, there we go. That'll, that'll, that'll be fine. Right, following the fungi. Or the fungi. There we go. Here's his English skin for you. Fungi, fungi. Um, oh, the psionic mouse has not has come up short. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. Society research gained 3,000. Nice. Actually, how is our research going on? Because that's slowed down a smidge. Mind you, I am pausing a lot more today. Oh, that's good. Oh, that's because a lot of these had quite a long bed in time. Okay, makes sense. Following the fungi, I already subbed to you. Thank you for that, Roach Mogul. <laughs> Much appreciated. Uh, and what's this? Ah, uh, yeah, borders closed with the Emperor, the Swalfins, it's fine. It's a peace treaty, and this is... Human tribes and the Melodic Hub. What is the deal with the hub? I can't figure it out. Do we know what their civics are? Do we have any idea? No, we still don't know where their civics are. And we never will, because that's as high as our intel will go. I... these guys still worry me. To go and spy on them? Uh, do I have a spare person? Uh, that guy's improved. I think the Dimian League are... I, actually, right, I don't think I need to be, uh, nice to the Dimian League anymore, because they're already, like, our buddies, so we, we could do... Let's, let's do a little, uh... Let's do a little gather information thing here. Can we just even do that? Oh, no, we can't, because... Difficulty! Hell! Um... Turns out their decryption might be pretty good. <laughs> no, I don't think I need to be nice to Kiryuan either. No, that's very true. Assets? No, there are no available assets. Oh, this is new! Assets can be... Oh, this is very new! I don't think this was, uh... I don't think this did this last time, did it? Okay, uh... Is that... is that how we do? I think that's how we do. Okay, cool. Let them build a spy network? Okay. Yeah, let's see, let's see what goes on there. Oh! Oh, that's very different. Okay. Uh, our great scientist, Bill Knight. Oh, Roach Mogul. Bill Knight Atom Crusher has passed away at the age of 87 while in service to our empire. People clamor for a memorial service to honor this leader's contrib contribution to the ascendant hegemony. We'll give everyone closure and bolster our ideals. Wow. Okay. So, not, not only does this... <laughs> Does Roach Mogul have main character syndrome while he's alive? He has main character syndrome when he, his characters die as well. I mean, dear God. Ah, I'm just my foot has not been going in the right place there. 
Okay. Uh, chant for their soul, which is uh, the religious option, or plan a grand parade. I feel a parade is more fitting. What, what do you reckon, Roach Mogul? It's your dude. You, 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 do you want a parade? Which we can easily afford. Or, or do you want chanting? You want a parade? I thought you might. <laughs> Let's do a parade. A huge parade of troops. I've never seen this before. This is great. Does anyone know what DLC this is from? Because I'm, I'm liking this. Um, I assume it's probably the one, the same one that lets us pick the traits and stuff, isn't it? I, I, I don't know which one it is. A huge parade of troops and a flyer by naval forces marked the arrival of Bill Nye Atom Crusher's casket to its final resting place. The departed leader's personal strategies and logbooks become part of the curriculum for the next generation of cadets. That's amazing. A galactic paragons. Ah, okay. So that's a fairly recent addition then. I quite like that. Oh, wow. Uh, military funeral modifier added for five years. Monthly unity plus 5%. Military built ships build speed plus 15%. I mean, considering you're a scientist, I think that's kind of funny. <laughs> but I'll I'll take it. Um, okay, we need to replace uh, that dude because I think he was in charge of uh, important shit. Oh, no, he wasn't. He was just very good at uh, uh, being a scientist. I thought he was on the council, but he wasn't. Um... Hang on a minute. Ah, okay. Now, the funny thing about that, that's now kind of broken our pre-scientist thing. Because we were at... Um... Five. Yes, it means there's a sleepy, a sleepy scientist, but a sleepy science ship even. Actually, going one over is okay, isn't it? Bill Nye, a scientist. I know Bill. Yeah, I know he's Bill Nye, the science guy. Um, unless he's been misleading everyone all these years, I don't know. Uh. Oh well, these guys have traits as well. Interesting. I mean, going over by one should be okay, shouldn't it? All right, Belgru Proudsworn. Uh, that's governing. That's archaeology. That's anomaly research. That's experience gain. That's survey speed. Hmm. Maybe anomaly research. Gome Onron. What a name. Uh. Oh, who, who do you want to? Who do you want to name Roach Mogul? Do you want me to hire somebody? Neil deGrasse Atom Crusher. <laughs> Excellent. Um. Let's go with archaeology. I think. Oh, we could go with leader experience gain. That might be a bad one, actually. Let's go with that one. Okay. Oh, more more things are pinging. Right. Uh, let's have a look here. Neil deGrasse Jazz fans guy. Yeah. Okay, and for some reason, uh, he's starting at level two. Oh, is this is this because of the uh, this this lady? I think. She gives. Does she make the. Uh, I don't know. Why my scientists are starting at level 2, I don't know, but I'm okay with it. Um, right, what have we got? Uh, experience gain, resilience, intuition. Oh, that's anomaly research. Okay. Um, I mean, more long lived? That's probably a good idea, isn't it? Or more experience. Resilience? Let's do resilience. Okay, cool. Right, so yes, there must be a sleepy science vessel somewhere. Uh. Oh, there we go. The Igongwat. Excellent. 
you are now the proud, proud, um, proud captain of the Agonglot, which apparently is, is not doing an awful lot. Oh no, it is, it's actually uh, excavating things, that's good. What are you doing? Uh, you are not doing anything right now. Um, is there anything for you to do? That's the question. Uh, what are you doing? You're literally doing nothing. Um, have we got our uh, no, we 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 are still cr making influence at an absolutely cripplingly slow speed, which is uh, not great. Okay. Uh, okay, they're getting there. That's fine. Oh, spy network established. Excellent. Whenever they make a move, we stand a better chance of it playing right into our paws. Oh, I love it. Um, let's have a quick look at that. Because I don't trust them. Uh, yeah, this is gonna this is gonna take a goddamn long time. Yeah. Okay. So. The big issue we've got there is their encryption is pretty bloody good. Which makes me wonder, are they hiding something? They probably are. Thanks, Mav! <sighs> All the things. Man, it's 20 plus 5 already. Jesus. How'd that happen? Ah. Yes, am I straight relative to the camera? Sort of. There we go. Not leaning off to one side or the other. Okay. Uh, let's carry on. Oh, wait. That's another dude that's not doing anything. Wait, that's the same dude that's not doing anything. Uh, yes, go do automated. Go do automated Shiznitsa. Holy fuck, what's that? Ah, that's a problem. The uh, Salona Kieran protectors just smashed the pirate fleet. What are they doing? Aren't they supposed to be sleepy? Oh no. Oh no. Oh, they're holy guardians. Okay. It's on their border? Oh, okay. Well, I hope they won't be too angry. Oh, I am not going to be able to rescue these people. This is going to be a problem. Or are they going to... Okay, we should probably watch this. 326,000. <laughs> this, this should be brief. This should be very brief. The ransom is assailed. <laughs> well, thanks, uh, crazy protector dudes. They literally they they one shot they one shot the station. That's that's terrifying. Uh, let's actually have a let's let's have a look at their stuff. Look at that. That's amazing. Hang on. Turns up, erases erases space station from existence, uh, departs, refuses to explain further. <laughs> Need more coffee. Read that as orgy. Uh, no, <laughs> no, no, no orgies in this one. So the Hegeonite captives managed to break out and steal a lifeboat during the attack, and now well on their way back to the Great Boar. Well, that was handy. A little bit anticlimactic, but, uh, you know. So does that mean that's now finished, or are they, like, on their way home now? Uh... I can't help but feel that would have worked better if we did it, but, I mean, I guess I'll take it. 
Oh, hello. Yeah, how, wait, how much military was that ship at space again? Uh... Three hundred and twenty-six thousand. <laughs> Damn. No, am I reading that right? Six numbers. That's big. That's a big ass fleet. That's a big ass fleet. Okay. Um. Time of our patronage is coming to an end. Uh, would you renew your prescription? These guys have done fuck all. So far. As far as I can tell. Alright, they give us some unity. I mean, I suppose unity is not bad. Minus 2,000. They have literally done nothing for us. I mean, they haven't, have they? As far as I know. We were interested in something else. I don't know. Didn't they, didn't they, like, every time they tried to do something, it broke? Is that honestly worth 2,000 energy credits? Ah, uh, I wonder if I told them to fuck off, what would it do? Nothing, apparently. Works for me. Yeah, every time they were kind of like, uh, we've broken something. Uh, we've lost something. Uh, sorry. Uh, can we do that? No, that's still happening. Celebrate diversity. Sell to private collectors. Oh, we could do, actually. That that gives us some uh, energy credits. Why not? Sounds good. Here, take this weird alien shit. Give me a good, uh... Give me a good, good rate on it. What is that? That was a space whale. Okay, that's fine. Oh, wow! Oh, holy crap! Okay, all of a sudden, uh, the Bin Penshan have just absolutely nobbled um, all the spare space here. Interesting. Okay, yeah, the, the Bin Penshan, I'm glad the Bin Penshan like us, because they are becoming large. They, they are the large. Right, you're not doing anything, science ship. Where are you? You are there. You are literally doing nothing. Look, there's, there's like, there's stuff to do here. Go forth and do it. Construction complete. Uh, what's that? Starbase? Cool. Construction complete. Something else being built? Uh, technology and, and, discovered. Anvil fleet is sleepy, but that's fine. Oh, technology discovered. What we got? Uh, Starbase building cost. I mean, that's a bit late, considering we've nearly maxed out our star bases, but that's good. Agenda ready. Ah, give me a chance game. God damn it. Right, new research. What we got here? Uh, engineering. Okay. Uh, oh, cruisers. Oh, cruisers. Tempting. Star fortress. Okay. Orbital habitats, uh, holographic casts. Wait, that makes no sense. You can't cast metal using holograms. What? Can alter their shapes at a moment's notice, speeding up alloy production? I mean, okay, sci-fi, sci-fi, but I'm pretty sure holograms are not very good at holding hot metal. <laughs> Says you, <laughs> hard light. Yeah, they bloody have to be, wouldn't they? Uh, yeah, we've got cruisers. <laughs> yeah. No brain scheme maneuver. Uh, right. Expand the council. So this is just a council position. Ready to be... Oh, hello. Ready to be designated. Now, this is... This is new. Okay. Minister of Ascension. Which sounds fucking funny. Council position for officials. Monthly unity plus 2%. Strong, because unity is quite useful. Principal instructor, leader experience gain. That's pretty good as well. I mean, I feel Ascend is the, is the, is the funny choice, isn't it? I think that's a good idea. 
Let's go for that. I like that idea. Principal instructor? Really? But Neil there. <laughs> I don't know, man. Monthly unity. Plus 2% monthly unity? That's pretty good. That means we can, like, advance our, um... <coughs> all the agenda things pretty rapidly. And also Ascension sounds bright because we're emerging from our tunnels. I like that idea. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go with unity. Right. Who should we put in here? What have we got? Uh, wait, have I only got two? Oh, three of three officials. Where's the third one? It says I have three officials, but I don't know whether... Wait a second, what's going on here? Oh, the game's paused! I You shouldn't do things when I'm paused. It's cheating. Oh, he... Okay, so Roach, Roach Crusher is ruling from the Great Ball. That is his job. Okay. Got it. But he's governing the Great Ball. Why have we got two people in charge of the same thing? That seems foolish. Oh well. It shouldn't... Oh, that's telling me the council position. Okay, that's fine. That's good. Put Neil there. <laughs> he's a scientist, though. Not an official. Um... Fundraising? Fun wow, yeah, no, that sounds, um... That sounds a very suspect, PM Collector Boy. Here's a Steam page for something we haven't finished yet. Yeah. Right, okay, so we have... Oh! Emperor Hedgehog Statin. Who has council agenda speed? God damn it, Roach Mogul, it's you again. Plus five percent council agenda speed, which is good. Ship build speed plus five percent. I I think that's a shoe in. Uh, planet and sector going. Okay, nope. I think I think that's a. Uh, God damn it. <laughs> it's bad enough he got voted the head of the empire. Uh no, that's good. That helps. Right. Uh, ooh. What other agendas have we got here? Um, a higher purpose. I mean, happiness is good. Chart the unknown. I mean, it's a bit late for that. Favoured society. Uh, that's quite nice. Give and take. Faction approval. Interesting. Infinite opportunities. Okay. Is it not? The Emperor's not yours? I think that was math. Was it math? I can't remember. It's somebody's. Makes a change. Makes a change. Get, like somebody else have some of the limelight. <laughs> Might be a scam. Yeah, it sounds, it sounds a little dodgy, doesn't it? it sounds a little dodgy. Uh, military build-up... Reorganized council? I mean, we just we just did that. Superior colonies. Hmm. Uh, maybe a higher purpose. And we have priests as well. That my scientist had a military send off. He really did. He really did. I need military build up. Fuck it. Right. Uh. Yep. No. That's fine. That is also fine. This is fine. Right. Can we not be humiliated anymore? Because that's getting boring. When's that? That's got to wear off at some point, surely. Is it, is it, is it there yet? 1.4 years, god damn it. I just wish I knew what happened. Because I honestly just 
don't recall anything like that happening. But it must have done, because it's there. But I'm still a bit baffled. Grimacing! Urgh. Right. A very geological struggle. Uh, right, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna read all of these out because I will lose my voice. <laughs> which I'm in danger of doing at the moment, actually. <laughs> it's coming up on six. I shall I shall go get myself Oh no, I'm out of lozenges. Shit. I will not be getting myself a lozenge. Okay. Um Oh it's a psionic mouse. Okay. Halt the planet's chaotic self-transformation. Interesting. 200 energy credits? I mean, that's a drop in the ocean. That's fine. A surgical terraforming strike. It's the Genesis device. If you're remotely familiar with any of the Star Trek movies, that's the Genesis device. <laughs> surgical terraforming strike. Beep. Uh, the Eldritch Oopsie 2 will have its 200 credits. Hang on, let's have a look. Spend energy credits to attempt to stabilize the planet in a more favorable state. A roughly 50% chance of success. Okay. Adds the Grimacing modifier to Varingathon V2A. I thought that was called Varingathon Vla, but that's not what it was called. Where is that? Just making sure that's not like... Oh, okay, we haven't actually claimed it yet. Okay. So if we blow it up, it's not so bad. Ferengathon, <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah, go for it. What's the worst that could happen? You could just blow the planet up some more. Uh, well, that didn't work. Oops. Turns out that that was an oopsie. So I imagine it probably could have... Uh, uh, yeah, it's barren. <laughs> it's fucked. So I guess we had a 50-50% chance of uh, of getting um, getting a planet out of that one. It's also telling me I have an open count. Oh, we do! The, the Minister of... What's happened there? Oh! Oops. Uh, right, by default it's going to have to be this guy then, because we haven't actually got somebody in charge of that, which is kind of funny. Oh shit, build speed. God, we've got build speed all over the place. This is good. Actually, can I, can I, uh, actually what I'll probably do, I'm going to wait until the cruiser tech uh, pops, and then I need to reinforce all my fleets with cruisers. Okay, that's a good plan. <laughs> Biddly bunk. Uh, storage full. Yes, the artifact. Again. Um, okay, no. I oh, can't do that. Uh, diversity? Oh, I don't know. Can we activate this? Nope, it's still active. Never mind. Um... God, honestly, at this rate, we could probably bribe somebody and say, would you like a steady influx of alien artifacts? Because apparently we can't get enough of them. Yeah, it's... It's it's not going well. It's, it's getting... I think it's actually getting worse. <laughs> You are officially being steamrolled by the Bin Penchan. Um, eh, yeah. But on the plus side, your ships look really cool. Oh. Shattered world? Wait, did somebody blow up did somebody blow up your home planet? Or was that supposed to be like that? That's, that's slightly worrying. Oh, it starts that way. Okay. <laughs> I was like, wow, that really would be uh, injury to insult there, wouldn't it? It's like, and we blew up your planet. Uh, that's rude. Crystal Codex. Special um, project complete. Oh, cool. Uh, a trilateral trade treaty between three major alien powers. Ooh, communicate with alien forces. Bit light. Expertise statecraft. Uh, research speed statecraft. Chance of statecraft research options. Interesting. Uh, I don't think he's on the council, actually. Uh, 
What was he called again? Mudot Craghelm. Okay. Empire Fix Calm. Ooh, okay. Why have we not made him the new... Oh, I know why we haven't made him the new Chief Scientist, because we still got that... Uh... We still got the lady we picked up at random, didn't we? That sounds wrong. The head of research is day seven. They think I'm one of them. Yes, it was clearly a, a, an alien spy. Um, but that's fine. Okay, that's cool. This is fine. That's a sleepy side ship. What are you doing? Absolutely cock all now. Uh, oh yeah, you're, you're rounding up all the critters. Yeah, I forgot that. I'll tell you what, why don't we just automate this? This makes perfect sense. Uh, yes, go research all the special projects. Yes, do that. What? Okay. Sometimes the automation on this makes no fucking sense to me. Because now he's going here. Why is he going here? That makes no sense. When there's, there's literally a special project right there... And he's like, no, I mean, literally next door, and I've told him to go automate, and he's just dodged around it. That makes no sense. So strange. Uh, okay, no, we haven't got mode stabilization. That's fine. Glorious. Everything is mostly okay. Mostly. Let's actually have a look at our, our entry points into our empire. So we've got some stuff here, which is good. Uh, that's an unresearched anomaly. You should probably look at that at some point. It's 5k in total, taking the station into account. Not bad, I suppose. But if somebody really wanted to stove us in, they probably could. Uh, that's 2,000. Did I reinforce the station? Looks like I did. Okay, that's not too bad. Wait, spinal... Wait, what? Oh! Huh. Just realised something. I forgot to tell the... defence things to use the psionic barrier. That's a slight oopsie. Uh, which now means, of course, they could use all the... Oh, they're already using the medium plasma throwers. Okay. Sounds like modern game dev decision-making. <laughs> in, in in what way, Sundog? I, I, I miss the reference. I frequently do that. Archpriest of the higher... Archpriest of the higher hedge. <laughs> okay. Uh, give me a sec. i got to figure out how we actually upgrade these. So if I save it, yes. So then how do we upgrade those? Because now that's... Oh, it's exactly the same. Upgrade all of them. Ah! Okay. Cool, cool, cool. Right, let's, uh, let's get Reg Mogul's Redemption going on. Government. Minister of the... Archpriest of the Higher Hedge. I do, I do like how you can just, like, t t rename anything. Quite funny. Arch Priest of the Higher Edge. There you go. Nailed it. Yeah, it's great. It's great. Roach Mogul's Redemption, is that even possible? <laughs> well, that's down to a jury of his peers, I feel. Hey, Serini, how's it going? Oh, welcome, welcome. I really want that modifier to quit so I can have more influence. That's, that's... I, I, I still want to know... Ships know. upgraded. <clears throat> I still want to know where the hell that, um... Uh... Humiliation thing came from, because I'm, I'm baffled. Why is it upgrading them? Okay, that's weird. Serena knows. <laughs> Ships upgraded. Right, we should probably uh, have a look at the space stations and see which ones have the defensive things. Wait, is this our home? Is this our home thing and it doesn't have a defensive platform? 
I mean, it is in the middle of my territory, so I suppose that's fine. It'll be it'll be fine, probably. Right, where's this? Uh, that doesn't have any. Uh, that does. Yep, great those. Thank you. Uh, yep. Uh, that doesn't have any. Uh, that doesn't need it, apparently. Okay, cool. These are good. These are nice, cheap upgrades. I like it. Where's the option to throw the Emperor in the river? <laughs> yes, or, or throw a lavish party. Yeah. Yeah, it's a bit of a shame, actually, because I think... Uh, is, isn't the King of the Castle um, on, their, on their servers winding down at some point? I, I vaguely remember Technology uh, discovered. their official thing saying that it's going to wind down, which is a bit of a shame. Because uh, it's an absolutely cracking game, that one. It, it's definitely... That, that game is a prime example of gameplay over graphics, which is something you don't get very often, that like the gameplay loop just transcended the look of it, which I thought was great. Um. Okay, what have we got here? The Ute Astronomical Interferometer. Still don't know what that does. Oh, Hyperlane Detection Range. I don't think we need that. Ancient Refinery, Energy Siphon, Artificial Moral Codes. Hmm, interesting. Uh, hydroponics, Fleet Command, Interstellar Campaigns. Ooh. What do we reckon? Uh, I mean, the artificial moral code sounds pretty good. Yeah, great oxymoron. Yeah, it is a little bit. Uh, hmm. And right now they're all of two people hosting games on Twitch. Yeah, it kind of, it kind of had a resurgence, and then it's like I think there's still some some people who have like dedicated their Twitch channels to it, and I think they're about the only ones that are playing it. But it's a bit of a shame. It was a really good name, a really good game, even. Uh, I mean, Fleet Command, win, uh, Command Cap, we're nowhere near, because I haven't built anything recently. Uh, though that wouldn't take very long, actually. That's pretty sure. Uh, yeah, fuck it. That's a short one. Ships upgraded. Uh, no, special sure. project complete. Oh, oh god, what special project? Ships upgraded. Right, it says special project complete, and it didn't actually tell me which one. Uh, that was weird. Egg. Oh, there we go. That's <laughs> a rampaging crusher droid. Oh, okay. A roving crusher droid served to ambush unwary explorers was encountered by our archaeologists on Tist 3. With a skill and a fair bit of luck, Scipio Excavatus managed to halt the rampaging robot before anyone was injured. Um, okay. That is... That's, um... Total Recall, isn't it? That's, that's the, uh, that's the tunneling thing from Total Recoil. Total Recoil. Total Recall, not Recoil. Total Recoil, I think, is a YouTube channel, but never mind. Uh, that was close. Yeah, no shit. And that's a gas giant? Why is that on a gas giant? Oh, uh, fair. That's slightly puzzling, but okay. Are these two separate things? I've, I've no idea. I feel it was unlikely those were the same thing in the same place, but, you know, what do I know? Uh... No, that was two different things, so what was the... I don't know, I'm lost. <laughs> no idea. No idea. Uh, oh wait, you guys in two different things, you are, okay. 
Right, are you just sat there doing nothing? You are, because god damn it, every time I automate something, it goes wrong. Um, actually, I suppose you could just keep surveying. That would be a smart thing to do. Uh, yes, complete doing that, because no one else is going to get these. Construction complete. Uh, do we have enough influence to take that? We do. Go grab it. Why not? I imagine we probably don't want to set up shop directly next door to the uh, angry rampaging marauder people. That would probably be a very poor choice. I'm still somewhat baffled how we've discovered... Oh, I think it must have been the... It was the Dimian League that discovered that. Okay. I was like, we went over there. How did we discover that? Every time all the machines would never try to usurp you. Yeah, it's true. Honestly, I'm almost tempted to 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 move the camera from here and put it on on the top of the secondary monitor. Because every time I turn, I look at chat. And, I, and I, I'm addressing chat and the thing is I'm turning away from the camera. <laughs> I might have to experiment with that at some point. Because it would make more sense if I, every time I turn to talk to you guys, I'm actually turning to look at the camera. That would make more sense. As opposed to the way I've got it at the moment, which is like the polar opposite. Uh, we'll figure it out. Uh, how bonks it is with the gameplay mods. Yeah, I, I didn't go too crazy with the gameplay mods because I knew the updates were coming. Um, I think the only gameplay mod... We've really got the mecha, I think. It's like real life. Now you need to embrace AI. No, no, I don't. No, do not embrace the AI. Under most circumstances, do not embrace the AI. Uh, orbital bombardment damage. Uh, fleet command limit. Commander capacity. Commander starting skill level. Ooh, that's nice. Uh, we like. Uh, yeah, let's have that one. We're definitely leaning into the whole militarist thing here. The next season is going to need a meeting. Yes. Yes, it is. Most assuredly. Well, we kind of had a mini meeting over this one, didn't we? I, 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 we, we sort of mostly wangled it over Discord. Because thank God I didn't try and do that live. That would have just been chaos. Uh, what, Serini? The civics and ethics mods that had cool shit. Oh, okay. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm, I'm slightly concerned about like adding stuff like that because there's plenty of official stuff in the DLC. But I mean, you know, I, I might look into it. I'm not entirely opposed. That's a noise. Pleasure Palace. Okay, slot machines and bodies. Oh, good. Empty escape pod bays. Uh, I got a hold of an Atlas 2H and kitted out like a Nicholas Corensi's Atlas 2 Unity. Nice! Yeah, Atlas, Atlas 2s are pretty chonk, aren't they? Uh, I can't remember the loadout on that one. But uh, yeah, that's, that's, uh, yeah, that's nice going. Curious. Very curious. Oh, it is the Rampage and Crusher Droid. Okay, that's quite funny. Why would you have a rampaging crusher droid on a gas station? These feel like terrible combos. Oh, also, have I missed something in the Senate? I might have missed something. Great, once again, I'm the only people, only person who is opposing this. What is this? Comfort the Fallen. Diplomatic weight from tech minus 20. Yeah, this is everyone looking at everyone else who's got better tech and going, yeah, we don't, we don't like it. Well, that's going to pass regardless. Uh, the Dibians don't... Oh, the Tarassians. Okay. <laughs> I was like, the Tarassians do not have an opinion about this. Uh, how's the mech bay going? Uh, good question. Where did I put it? Is it... Uh, no. Where was it? Uh, no, not there. Uh, oh! Uh, yes, it's there. Apparently we can already upgrade it, which is interesting. I can upgrade it to a medium mech bay. I think I'll do that right away. Uh, right, so how does this work? Armies. Brute. Ah, uh, here we go. 
Uh, LBX10 clan... LBX10 clan. Nice. LRM20 clan. SRM6... Oof. That sounds like a beefy mech. I like it. Yep, that, that sounds like quite a beefy mech. Right, light mech lance. Morale damage to do... Valuable of variable light mechs active is less than four. I'm just gonna build one of these for comedy value. Oh, what's a paladin squad? Oh, we can't build that because we haven't got a paladin order. Okay. And why do they do more damage? Mm -hmm. I mean, this is probably not the, the correct thing to be building here. I'm just, I'm just tinkering. Uh, Paladin Order. Here we go. Defense, Army, Health, Housing, Bombardment, Damage, Priest Jobs, Paladin Jobs. Yeah, okay. Why not? Let's go all in. Why not indeed? Right, can we sell any of this? Uh, yes we can. More energy credits? Don't mind if I do. Okay, our resources appear to have unfucked themselves, still, other than influence. That's still slightly humped at the moment, but that's okay. This is fine. Construction complete. Uh, what was that? Uh, Starbase. Oh, yeah, yeah, because I was taking I was taking this spot over, wasn't I? All right, what are you doing? Okay, you're building a mining station. That's good. You're surveying. Shelter of Devotion sounds like a slightly worrying uh, location. Also appears we can't actually get to it. Survey complete. Why can't we get to it? Binary stars. Oh, it's a nebulae. Okay. Interesting. So there could be anything lurking in there. That could be bad. Nothing good lurks in a nebulae. Uh oh wait I've got like two SAR systems I just totally haven't claimed that's that's a oh well move there and then hopefully right are we are we nearly out of this humiliation bollocks because yeah no it's cool uh, Roach Mogul I I I was a bit worried about it to begin with but it didn't look like I thought it was gonna be like super OP but it, it didn't look too bad so yeah I, I wanted to have a look at it. Has the humiliation worn off? Yay, the humiliation's gone. Okay, good. Good, 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 good. Right, now our fucking influence should come up a little bit now. Jesus. I still don't know what we Technology did. Technology discovered. To actually earn that, but apparently... Oh, hello. Seralians? <gasps> Wait, we've got Seralians. Ooh. Ooh. We can colonize places I didn't know we could colonize before. Also, there's an anomaly up there. I've utterly failed to notice. Um, right, go, 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 sort that out. I'm, I'm intrigued. We're a big kid now. Yeah. Uh, planetary FTL inhibitors. Uh, cool. And what was the other one? Uh, space combat. Cool. Right, physics. What have we got? Uh, chemical plants, barrier point defense, improved deflectors. I mean, do we need improved deflectors now we've got the psionic one? Do we? Do we really need those? Uh, quantum energy states. That could be handy. Uh, I almost called that the Moan Drining Laser, which is something else. I might go for the uh, Quantum Energy States, to be honest. Shield hit points 100. I think that's just as good as the Psionic ones, isn't it? I don't think we need those. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have more energy. Yeah, mm -hmm. definitely. Okay, we've got uh, Fleet Command Limit, which we just did on somewhere else. Tile Blockers. Uh, you got to tell me how many of these we've got. No. Is it, well, shit, that's not what I wanted to do. Thank you. Try again. 
I was trying to get it to tell me. Ah, okay. Three impossible mountains. Okay. Colonial bureaucracy. Faculty of Archaea Studies. Energy siphons. Ancient refinery. Um, I'm not sure. Me tile blockers, maybe? Wait, base intel level? Oh, colonial bureaucracy. Okay, that could be interesting, actually. Also, that's actually short. Or relatively short. Yeah, I'm going to go for that one. And on that note, I'm going to grab a break. Because uh, everything is going on quite swimmingly. So let's put a save in here. Something's going to go wrong. Waiting for something bad. That's what we're doing. You're always waiting for something bad in this game. Uh, hey, Yarny Land, how's it going? Oh dear, that's terrible timing. I'm literally about to go off and have a break, but thank you very much for dropping by. Hello! Uh, give me a second, I shall give you a shout out. Welcome! Yeah, that's okay. It's yeah, half the time, like I'll get a raid or something just just when I'm uh, I'm about to <laughs> about to have a break or something. But yeah, I'm just gonna pop off for a ten minute break. But thank you very much for dropping by. Yes, go uh, go check out La Yarny Land. We uh, we raided uh, them after we did our Dark Tide um, uh, session yesterday, and they're lovely people. So go check them out. They're just waking up. <laughs> uh, that's all good. Right, yeah, sorry, I need to go get a drink, uh, stretch my legs, and things like that, so I'm going to be back in about 10 minutes or so. If it goes over 10 minutes, I shall tack on some more time uh, on the end of the stream, because uh, I think it's a good habit to get into. But uh, I shall see you guys in a wee while. Oh, oh they're already here. Oh, they're all friendly, Mercs. They'll be friendly in all of them now. Oh, this oh. does happen from time to time. We beat the shit out of someone and they decide to join us because reasons. Yeah, friendly <laughs> friendly, friendly, friendly mechs. Sorry about that. What do they bring? Friendly mechs, here is Hamster. Follow him. Oh, he is no. Your friend. No. You guys are closest. He is your babysitter for no, the second. No, no, I'm, don't, backing, don't away. Advance, I'm backing away. Let's where see, are they going? Let's see where they go. Oh, no, they're going. <laughs> oh, where they're going. They're going. Oh, where they're going. Oh, no. They're going. Oh, where they're going. No. 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 Not again. Not like this. Not like this. Right, I'm going this way. No. <laughs> no, Thank you're you fucking, you you're off fucking off the, kidding uh, me. The <laughs> Fuck off! I don't want the responsibility. Leave me alone. Oh god. <laughs> right. Good. Superb. Okie dokie. Okay. Right. Uh. So we want to get. Mm, we want to get that close, actually. Or maybe we could shoot the table. Hang on a minute. We are gonna be we are gonna be so disappointed. Okay, I, I might be able to shoot the table and possibly the floor, apparently. Or maybe I can get rid of the table. Okay. So it turns out that shotguns are infinitely more powerful than AK-47s. Which, I suppose, kind of makes sense. <laughs> that's destroyed a quarter of the house! Oh, that's amazing. Well, I'm glad you guys talked me into it, because that's actually quite funny. And great. Look at this <laughs> giant sea of cargo pods I've left behind. I am not doing responsible wombling. That is not responsible wombling. I've actually left more crap behind than I picked up. I am now the anti-womble. Making good use of the things that we find, leaving all the excess shit floating behind. <laughs> Turning it into a hazard, hazard for all the spaceships. I'm covering the galaxy in huge piles of shit. There you go. Moving on. I wonder how long they microwave liberty. We're not microwaving liberty. No, do not microwave the liberty. Orbital inbound. That's Gordon, heresy, that Gordon is. Gordon Ramsay will hunt you down and eat yeah, your that, children. Yeah, that, 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 that's Sorry, heresy. Tommy. That's what that is. I know. Oh. <laughs> oh my god, we're just barraging everything. This is great. I love it. I think we can call this the word of the day is excessive force. Yeah, no, it's it's just about the right force. 
<laughs> oh, hang on. Right, ghoulie shots. Oh, yeah, look, the ghoulie shots work. You're right. I told you. Yeah, I oh, told shit, you. I'm out of fucking ammo. Damn it. The ghoulie shots. Ghoulie I shots. Cool than that, but I'll take it. <laughs> ghoulie shots. Behold the ghoulie shots. Super effective. Mm, I found my calling. <laughs> I'm hiding well there. away from you lot. Staying up here. Oh. This isn't, this isn't level the city because it's a new way. Level the city? Very good, my lord. <laughs> oh, no, I was gonna say, you said the words. I don't like how that shell went right over my cockpit. I... Could have been worse. Could have been through your cockpit. I am aiming way above you. Wait, have I got way some? Way above I'm further you. in front, and I saw I hear a gunshot, like and then I see the clouds. It does not feel like that, good sir. <laughs> I am a taller <laughs> man. <laughs> <laughs> and here we see the Kentaro and the Hunchback having the <laughs> annual argument of fisticuffs <laughs> due to errant artillery shells. Getting into fisticuffs. In the natural environment, the densely populated urban area. Uh, I mean, in a, in a sphere, Max, yes, the natural thing of fisticuffs is a thing. Yep. Really? We we just descend into rock and sock and robots. <laughs> <laughs> hey, fists, notely reloading. <laughs> I did not notice the Orion were facing the wrong way. Let's hope the other one isn't missiles. On me. Oh, fuck me! What was that? Armor blow through. Internal damage. Holy fuck, what was that? Uh, well, I think the Orion's dead. <sighs> Luckily, they fired the missiles at the Archer. Okay, that looked like some sort of plasma thing, but holy shit, what was that? If I if I have noticed that I was facing the wrong way, I might not have done that. Death ray, I think. Oh great! Uh, yeah, there you go. Wow. Okay. Can I get that close? I don't think I can get that close. Okay, we'll do. Okay. This should be fine. There we go! Actually, hyenas are no joke, actually. They are, like, just... death and muscle. Even more efficient if we put in some extra effort. Oh, okay, they can go pretty fucking far. Jesus Christ! That's some horseshit! Holy fuck! Okay! I should have taken them a bit more seriously. Bloody hell! I mean, I get hyenas are fast, but fuck me, that, that like, covered half the map! What's that blue laser? What's that blue laser? Die! Die, you Why is there a blue thing? laser? What is that blue laser? What is a blue laser? I'm, I'm, I'm the evac. <laughs> oh, somebody just got. <laughs> <laughs> What's that blue well, laser? Figured... Squish. Well. <laughs> have, have we learned something today? I feel we've learned something. Oh dear. Uh, oh boy. Oh, that's the. Uh, there, don't go. I just got hit by the dropship. Oh, toaster! I know your pain. I know your pain. Somebody bring oh, him back. Oh my word. I just want to escape. Eat. I just want to go home. Well, you can once you're ready. I mean, you got to escape Eat. indefinitely. Fuck yeah, I'm off. Uh, Bye. Let's catch you guys later. <laughs> oh, God. Toaster got exhausted. Yes, he oh. did. Yes, he got exhausted. What's the... What's... Are we supposed to... Oh, oh we around. got chaos. <laughs> oh, look, they're in the... Uh, yeah. I can't get over here. I'm too short. They're in the fields. Go, my um, okay, that guy doesn't no, have no, a head. No. That's good. Oh wait, I'm supposed to use my crossbow. The necromancer doesn't stand out very well against. I can't see over the. I can't see over the corn. I'm too short. Get on a <laughs> rock, short deck. I need a. I need a tactical rock. In great games workshop <laughs> tradition, I need a tactical rock. Oh. Uh, there we go. That's better. That interns. You did such a good job. 
I've suddenly found the slight drawback of being a dwarf. <laughs> you are small. I'm small. Not very big at all. Cannot see over the corn. The oh god, I bet that looks cursed on the stream because that was like nothing but vegetables. Fish, the Urian. Didn't I? Didn't I do that already? I'll have a look in a second. Oh, that's not what I meant to do. I clicked the wrong thing. Oh. I clicked the wrong thing. Uh, that didn't do what I thought it would do. <laughs> that was a misclick! Oh, no. Well, that's that. Never mind. Oops. Um, well, we don't have to worry about them anymore because they just blew themselves up. Oh, <laughs> uh, oops. I thought when it says there's no need for espionage, I thought that means we'd reveal ourselves to them, but that just means we'd stop giving a shit. Oh well, never mind. Yeah, congratulations. It's, uh, potentially habitable. <laughs> no, he's completely blocked. Uh, take, take cover. cover. This is gonna go so wrong. Oh yeah, they got grenadiers! Excellent. Help, help. I'm being suppressed. Miss. Solid. Oh, okay. That's a gunner. Okay, okay, okay. Well, that's not good. Oh! Nobody told me that exploded. What the fuck was that? No, not having that. No, no, no. Nobody told me that exploded. That's some horseshit. <laughs> I'll see, you know, giant mecha. Oh my god! You motherfucker! Wait, 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 hold on. Hold on, hold the- wait, 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 hold the fucking phone. God, I love the fact that if you look to the right and left, you're right. If you look to the left and right, you can see plenty of aircraft guns firing into the sky. Oh! Oh yeah, sky fire cannons, I remember those. Right. Uh, the best place to hold is up here where I am. Which is up here, and they'll open for you. Right, I got an ammo crate. So, if anyone gets short, drop it, yell. Like, just drop it here. Drop it? Okay, roger that. Yeah. Literally, this is the last bit. Like, the earth thing, this bridge extends, and this is where the it Oh, uh, okay. Uh, I've got a med, uh, oh, med that's, bag as well. If that's you toaster, need. sorry. You have to, um, do the sky fire first. Oh! Beauty! Whoa! Yeah, got him! <laughs> Ooh, please don't explode. Never mind, yeah. I... <laughs> Keep your eyes peeled. They are stealthy boys. Oh, okay, stealthy boys. Oh. Well, one of them came up right behind me and I had absolutely no chance whatsoever. Okay. Oh. No, 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 it's fine. The final responsibility ultimately does does lie with the street I was largely joking. I feel but Oh, I found it! I found a stalker! Okay, I think about the, the the yeah. Okay, here he comes. He thinks I can't see him. I'm gonna I'm gonna uh, make him think he hasn't seen me. And surprise, motherfucker! <laughs> I had on burst fire and he nearly killed me. Whoops. Wow. <laughs> That's hubris. Wow, they take a How lot of bullets. Fucking hell. Yes, they do. Uh, okay. Weapon. Coordinates. Atlas shrugged, motherfucker. Kachonk. Kablam. That's a breach. And eat shit! <laughs> that was an XL engine, too. 
Oh my god, that thing is cracked. I love it. Actually, in fairness, who is the Mumaduck this who's, time? Who's, oh, who's, who's? Oh, looking at me. I saw them look at da me. Uh, they can feel yep. free to follow me if they want. They're going <laughs> straight for. Hey, what the hell? Whoever! Holy hell! Holy hell! Rifleman, 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 rifleman! They're moving herds! They're moving herds! Oh my god, that's not right! Na 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 I, I am also a rifleman. That is going to be an amazing th amount of fire until one of them gets shot. Until one of them <laughs> explodes and, yeah. then, and it's the rest. Oh, that's a... Alrighty, we're back. That was more like quarter of an hour rather than ten minutes, but uh, I shall tack on some extra time at the end of the stream. And uh, yes, I have tea and bickies. Had a quick chat with my dad as he come in the front door. And, uh, yes, I'm gonna my biscuits quick. Um. Maybe not that quick. <laughs> we have surveyed the planet Motha! Which we now need to claim, quickly. Mine, 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 oh I can't. Son of a bitch. Have I already sent someone there? No, I haven't. Ah, oh, this influence thing is killing me! That's so annoying! I hates it! See so yeah, for next stream, uh, whenever that happens to be. Uh, hey Creek Osman, how's it going? Welcome, welcome. May your shovels be ever sharp. And your gas marks never fall off. Um, yeah, next stream I might, I might, I honestly might put the the camera on top of the second monitor. So when I turn to to talk to chat, we'll see what chat is saying. I'm actually looking at you guys, which actually might work out better. But um, we'll we'll see how it goes. Uh, I think you missed an S there, unless I mistyped it wrong, which is also possible. Let me just double check. S C L S Q. Boop. There you go, nailed it. But sometimes I have to double check that I've got it right myself. <laughs> I don't trust myself. Right, this is going very well. I'm slightly worried about how well this is going. I'm going to be brutally honest with you. I'm waiting for the other shoe to drop. Construction complete. What's this? Uh, research agreement proposal. The egg aman and the solitary. Oh, this could be bad. Okay. So if the egg aman are actually making overtures to the solitary solidarity of Golfis, this could be bad. We may have to get the bin penchan on our side a bit sharpish. I think I might have to do that, actually. Where's our old uh, diplomacy nonsense? Gone back into Battletech again? Excellent! Yeah, we're, we're giving uh, we're giving Battletech Advanced a bit of a break. Uh, we've kind of gone headfirst into uh, Stellaris for a bit, but we, we will come back to Battletech. It's, it's, uh, it's always in the back pocket, but j just for now, we're giving it a bit of a rest. Uh, where are the bits? There they are. And we Im I had forgotten the freaky ass lunatic noise that these people make every time you talk to them. Wait, what the hell's this? The Mulgarima Uprising? Offensive war. Wait, why would Huh? Why is it called the Mulgarima Uprising? Enemies. Egg, Amman, Enlightened Kingdom, Kyrian Empire, Serenian State, Satishan Covenant. Okay, maybe I don't want these guys on my side, because everyone else hates them. That's interesting. 
What is going on there? That's mighty curious. So are they... Do they honestly think that they can take on... Everybody here? Apparently they do. Hmm. No reason not to pre improve relations with them, though, so let's do that. Uh, where are we? Diplomacy! Never get... This is why I don't want to talk to these people. Because you get the funny things. Oh, yes! Okay, right, we promised... We promised, uh, uh Roach Mogul we'd actually try and talk to the, the, uh... Kiriwin, didn't we? Let's, let's see what we can do here. I mean, they're at war with a bit of Penchan, it's not great. You guys, you guys are still... I can't do anything. You guys are still in neutral relations. Uh, I know it says, Empire views us as a friend, may be willing to form an alliance with us. I mean, that's unlikely. Friendly first greetings, galactic community member. Egalitarian rabble? Oh, they think we're egal egalitarian rabble. Okay. The funny thing is, they like us more than we like them. <laughs> Which is kind of amusing. Oh, trust plus 17. Okay, what can we do here? Ask for association status? That would involve us joining them. Offer my... No, 20 trust. No, 20 trust. No, 20 trust. No. Uh... Not... Not much. Uh, how is trust generated? That's something I'm not super clear on. Nah, Secret Fealty's got a... Uh, minus 2,000 and... Minus 2,230. Because they are... They, right. Unfortunately, Roach Mogul, you guys are utterly loyal to their overlords. I mean, utterly loyal. They, they are loyal and in a federation with their overlords. I don't think this is going to work. <laughs> I tried. I did my best. Um, unfortunately, I, I believe your empire is being used as the tip of the spear, um, for somebody else, which is, uh, unfortunate. No problem? Well, that is, that is the, the beauty of this game. You really have no goddamn clue what's gonna happen. Okay, brace, brace for it. Sorry, this is gonna be like the third time. <laughs> Same to you, sir. And a mighty o o o o o to you and and yours, <laughs> fucking weirdos. And the only reason I'm being nice is I've got quite a chunk of territory. Imagine you said their fleet power is pathetic in comparison to ours, so I don't know what they've been doing. Beating up foxes, by the looks of it. The Swalfins have been surprisingly quiet. I think possibly because they've bumped up against two fallen empires. Um, which I, I'd be quiet if I was doing that, to be honest. I gotta be honest, I am slightly worried what the Gorfists are doing. Again, they've been very quiet. How does their power compare to ours? Uh... Oh, pathetic. Okay, so I'm in, in the, like, you know, space north. Apparently I am the, the... the biggest military power in space north at the moment, which is kind of interesting. Um... I wonder at some point we can put the, uh... Terassians on their ass. That could be quite funny. It's always the quiet ones. I know, tell me about it. The, uh, oh, eh. the Thug Med. That's such a comedy name for something. Uh, right, why are you not... Oh yes, again. No influence. God damn it. Uh, wait, hold on. Is that two? No, that is two. Okay. See, this is... Okay, there's something definitely screwed up with the automated queue. With the construction ships. Because it's like... They're both on automated construction. One of them turned up here and is building a mine, which makes sense. 
The other one is on automatic construction, but it's just sat there doing bugger all. Which does not make sense. Especially as there's... there's yeah, I, I, I don't know. I don't understand. Right. Uh, are you still doing things? Uh, yep, you're doing the anomaly. Oh, yeah, we can call... Okay, right. So because... What is this species we've got? Which enables us to colonize... Ceralians. Where do they fit in? Uh, not so galaxy species. Ceralians. Ceralians. Oh my god. Ceralians. Lithoids. Ceralian is a species from the planet Sar Alged, which are the. Oh, triple headed. Oh god, what are these guys' deals? Uh, now I'm finally at the PC. Excellent. <laughs> Too long, didn't read. They've got overlapping orders. Oh, okay. Because I guess that 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 might have been. Oh, okay. I kind of understand. Um. So what empire did this lot belong to then? The Cerulean State. Okay. Blessings upon you, Anxiate Hegeans, comrades, and welcome to you, triple-headed freak free. Ugh. Even though apparently you're a, you're, a, you're made of stone, but okay. Oh, is this like a tiny, tiny place? Oh no, the Ceralians are the, are the green bit here. Okay, that's interesting. So what are they doing in my territory? Have I got... Has there been like a... I wonder if there was like a random migration treaty somewhere that somehow overlapped with my stuff. I don't quite know how that works. Because I didn't make an a, 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 a treaty with them, so who cares? Free planets, I'll have it. Um, exofungus infestation. Okay, uh, maybe not the greatest idea, but I don't think that's going to slow them down, which is kind of funny. Uh. Oh god, I forgot we've even got Rayogans. Okay, I, I don't remember having a migration treaty with them either, but that's also fine. Uh, um, sure. What are these guys? Ocean preference. Makes sense. Wait, tropical, ha tropical habitability 60%. Why is that 100? Oh. Uh, lithoids. Replaces food upkeep with minerals upkeep. Ah, okay. They eat rocks. Existential... What? Oh my god, what the hell is this? Existential iteroparity. Population growth during war and crisis plus 30%. I'm learning, learning new words. What the hell is iteroparity? So basically, there's a war on everyone's shags. Okay, cool. I should, I should introduce them to the fertility priest. Um... Yeah, sure. Why not? Why not? Go forth. Go forth and eat rocks. We still haven't found that, um... Uh... What's it? Uh, edict, building, whatever. To increase the envoy pool, which is kind of awkward. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> he likes those guys. Yeah, exactly. Oh! Oh dear. The Star Nation, formerly known as the Galactic Human Tribes, have been destroyed by its enemies. Ah, uh, they were... What happened to them? They were, like, down here somewhere? Who got them? That's interesting. Did they, like, piss off the wrong person? I think they were down here somewhere. Well, that's unfortunate. Now, who would have done that? Because... I don't think... Oh, hmm, I'm intrigued. I am the intrigued. They were down here somewhere. Ah, Sol. Oh! It was the Ceralians. The Ceralians ate them. Oh. Uh, well, there we go. Bye-bye, humanity. Oh, now, why would the Ceralians do that? 
did they did they declare war on them? Because that would have been really silly. Oh well. Yep, they have absorbed the humans, indeed. Well, I mean, technically, Roach Mogul, even though your empire is in a bit of a mess, um, because you're backed by this lot, I, I guess you're kind of okay. Um, I don't know what the Bin Penshan are doing with this, um, territory. It's kind of random. Because they don't technically, they own it, but I don't know what's going on there. Oh, it's occupied by them, but it's fully occupied by you. Okay. I'm just not, yeah, I mean, it, 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 I reckon it'd be fairly easy if you guys, like, yacked out some uh, invasion fleets. Um, you could probably take this back, but uh, your guys seem quite reluctant to do that. Uh, oh, is these the mechs we just built? I think it was, wasn't it? Uh, army strength 60. I mean, yep, they're not exactly... They're not exactly overpoweringly scary, are they? Uh, do we only build the one? It's entirely possible I, 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 I goofed when I built it. Is that only one, or was that...? Oh. Okay, that was... That was a bit weird. Wait, AMD to emplacements? What's this? That's four mechs, a whole lance? Oh, okay! What the heck's an AMD to play, uh, emplacement? Automated mobile defense platforms designed to hold up assault forces and provide protection for other ground forces. Oh, yeah, because that mod changes how ground combat works in its entirety, doesn't it? Ah, uh, okay. Wait, can we build a paladin squad now as well? Oh, we can. Whether we should or not, I don't know, but I just did. Interesting. Interesting. Not that I'm planning on invading anyone soon, but uh, it's, it's... Oh, shit, it's another planet. I don't know, I legit do not know why we have Ceralians, but we have Ceralians, and they're doing work for us. So I'm okay with that. This is fine. Um, anything going on here? No. Excellent. Everything I oppose, everyone else goes for. This is, this is kind of funny. Mechs, walker tanks, and power armor soldiers. Okay. Oh. What is that? Uh, comfort the Fallen has passed. Oh, well, we didn't have much of a choice in that, so that's a whoop de doodle Our influence is still complete. not huge. Have we have we built cruisers yet? I want cruisers. Uh, tech, here we go. Oh, no, no, that's going to take quite some time. Hey, Kermify! So there's offensive ground troops named Intel something. Yeah, I don't... I think maybe some of the labels aren't quite working. Um, because, yeah, it said something like... Uh, what did it do? Oh, no, it wasn't there. It was here. Uh, where we go? Go recruit. Oh, no, AMD soldier count. That's right. Uh, how's it going, Kirby for my Oh, unless of course that's the that's the kind of uh, Darius joke. Is it is it we can we can build a, a, a something that doesn't gather gather very good intel? That would be great. That would be the cherry on top. We've gathered intel. It's incorrect, but go with it anyway. Aha! Uh -huh. Okay, the psionic mouse has uh, leveled up. Leader upkeep. Effects apply while not on the council. Oh, that could be handy. Expertise voidcraft. Research speed as counselor. Now, if we didn't have that incredibly broken paragon lady in charge, I would go for voidcraft, but we've got that incredibly broken paragon lady in charge, so I'm going to go for that. <laughs> 
Anywhere you put a mech bay, you get a free defense lance of each weight class. Uh, let's have a look. Um, don't appear to have done. That's a that's a bin pension uh, garrison. It's not uh, a mech garrison. That is my defense army, isn't it? Yeah, armies. That that is my defense. That is my defense armies. That's all there is. Unless I'm missing something. Uh, yeah. Is that possibly not working? <laughs> yeah, maybe the update. Maybe the update in the mod. That's fine. Gives us options. I was. I, I'm largely experimenting with it to see what it's like. I don't think. We've, I don't know if we're going to be able to build things in big numbers, but uh, it is intriguing. And who is this science vessel? The bin, what is the Bin Penchan doing in my territory? Did I not close my borders to them as well? Oh, they've closed borders to me, but I didn't close borders to them. Son of... Shut up, you stupid rock people! No, my borders are closed. So how have they got a science... How the... Oh, science vessels can travel freely. I forgot about that. It's the construction ships that can't. That's it. Science vessels science vessels can go wherever the hell they like. I forgot about that. Uh, oh, who's in Salty Who? Uh, rivalry has ended between the Solidarity of Gorphis and the Terrassian Despoilers. Okay. I wonder if I've got enough money to send the uh, raiders off against the Terrassians again, because that was really funny last time. I want to do it again. Uh, no, that's talking to the Terrassians. I want to talk to... Oh, God. Honestly, the names in this, i, I got to get my head around it. Azathians, that's it. Send them after the rocks? Why would I want to send them after the rocks? We're on quite good terms with the rocks. <laughs> yes, uh, from, from, from your uh, viewpoint, uh, Roach Mogul, I'm sure they do. However, I'm not going to do that. Because uh, that would cause a diplomatic incident. They won't know. They m they'll they never know. <laughs> I, 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 no. I love this. Uh, only thing worse than a Dwamak is a Dwakam. No, do not do not ask what it is. Aye, 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 aye. Okay, good rating target. Also, I can't actually tell them because they're not in... I think it's, they have to be... I think they have to be in direct opposition. We would like to hire a, a leader. We can hire a leader? Oh... That could be funny. How much does that cost us? Hire Admiral. Minus 2,000. Uh, you permanently hire a skilled Zathian Admiral. Hire a General. Interesting. Hmm. Maybe, maybe when one of our guys pops their clogs, we might, we might come back and hire one. But for now, I'm going to send them up against the... Uh, Terrassians, because it makes me laugh. Oh, when I actually get it right. Right, third third time of asking. Right, go raid the Terrassians, it's funny. We'll pay. Minus 3,000. I can afford it. The Dwamaks are in for Bash Bash. That's what we like to hear. So that turns that fleet neutral, which means they can cross through. Okay. Well, actually, I presume they can cross through. Ooh. Okay. Beautiful bubble. Surface scans of Demon Demon 3B, as you know. 
Uh, okay. I don't think we have anyone over there. I mean, we do, but he's busy. Wow, look at the speed that he's got. Is that the, is that the Eldritch Oopsie ship? That is the Eldritch Oopsie ship. Great stuff. Survey complete. I'm slightly worried about getting too close to these guys, but it'll be fine. A multiplayer game of this between the VIPs, you would be crazy, crazy shit. I would get rolled. I think I would get rolled. I've got three construction ships here. This is what is going on. Oh my god! Right, one of you build an outpost. Uh, somebody else. Give, can you go build? No, nope, haven't got enough. You go there. I think what it is. I keep accidentally selecting multiple things, and uh, it gets confused. Or I get confused, which is equally likely. Right, uh, you're still moving around. That's fine. We'll come back to that. There we go. We've got them going in three different directions now. Oh, that's not good. New negative trait. Commander Shepard II got a negative trait. This leader, Alloys Upkeep plus five, controversial reputation. Well, that sucks. Uh, what's he doing? Oh, he sat on the border twiddling his thumbs. That's probably why he's not very happy. Oh, well. The Star Petal. I'd be on your side, though. <laughs> good, good to know. Um... A celebrated luxury resort. But everyone died. Suffered critical damage. Okay, somebody somebody forgot somebody parked it in the wrong place. Honestly, we should uh the museum exhibits. Put minor artifacts on public display. Okay, planetary decision? Right, okay, what if we did that in the capital? I want to do that. I want to do that in the Great Ball. Comedy value. Priest output plus 20%. I don't know what priests do, but I guess that's good? Why not? And also, I love the fact there is a planet called Zog. Oh, priests do unity? Okay, that was a good... That, that's not a bad shout at all, then. I like it. Dus Ulpa. Yes. Oh, yeah, there's a bunch of, like, uh, resources that haven't been tapped here. Because, frankly, my uh, construction ships are very confusing. Right. Asteroid Vault. Oh, hello! Esoteric collection of items ranging from junk. Ooh, what we get? Oh, wow, okay. Uh, research option gain. Self-evolving logic. Ancient saturator artillery. And progress to ancient saturator artillery tech. I mean, saturator artillery sounds, sounds fun. <laughs> Uh, okay, cool. That's the same thing. Uh, does that mean you guys are sleepy time, or are you are you are you okay now? No, I think you're okay. Construction complete. Probably should check in on our uh, colonies at some point. Galactic saturation snake. <laughs> that sounds that sounds like a like a game you'd be worried about playing. Um. Right. Did I not tell him to build there? I thought I did. No, I didn't. Are these guys just completely ignored what I told them to do. I think they might have done. Right. Build outpost. Uh, we automate you as well. There you go. Sometimes my brain gets confused about the automation button, whether it's on or off. I don't know why. Because it's pretty obvious when it's orange, it's on. Uh, 
Ah, relic activation. Good stuff. We can use the Ute Cryo Core. Or shall we not bother? Energy weapon firing rate. Ship upkeep minus 20. It's nice, but I think we should accum accumulate some more unity in order to push our... Push our stuff along, maybe. Actually, how long is that going to take? That's a good question. Uh, cost 19... Oh, so we need double that. Okay. Because I just realised, every time I do that, it's, it's slowing down my next... Um, upgrade thing. Maybe when we actually get into a fight, I might activate it. That might be a good, good idea. When it gets like proper, a proper Barney, as we say. Oh, hello. On the crew's arrival to Sula Bindones. Bindones? Bindones? I don't know. Wow, it suddenly got very bright in here. Sorry if my, uh... <laughs> from, from, from the right-hand side here, the sun is coming in like a madman. So I'm very oversaturated on one side and slightly gloomy at the front, which sounds about right for me. Um, their sensors were indeed malfunctioning. Initial estimates of the star's energy output grossly underestimated. Neil deGrasse Atom Crusher seems to have learned from past mistakes. Neil deGrasse Atom Crusher gains the perfectionist trait. Science ship effects, anomaly discovery chance plus 10%, 200. Nice. God damn it. Honestly, Roach Mogul, what is it? Every time, every time you name somebody, something happens. It's it's amazing. Each time Roche Mogul does a redemption, an amazing transformation occurs. Right, how long is it before that uh cruiser tech? Fucking another seventy two months. God, I could build another fleet. I think I might as well I'll build another fleet, or maybe just merge one. Build one, merge one. Or make the ones I've got slightly bigger, maybe? That might be no idea. Let's have a look. Alright, where are you? You're just sat there. Actually, can we merge these two? Oh, the Artificer fleet is huge. Okay. Um, we've already got somebody watching out for us on that side. And there. There's another anomaly we've missed. Oh, hello. Okay, so this is amusing. The uh, Swalford Empire has pushed through here, but they can't take this system either. Why have I not taken that one? I should have taken that. It's literally on my doorstep. Imbuing each of them with Pinocchio magic and then I'm a real main character. Yeah. It's kind of funny. It has it has become a bit of a meme because it happened in BattleTech as well. You had you had a very storied life in BattleTech. Um, bu, 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 bu. where should I? I mean, maybe just having them at the capital might not be a bad idea. I don't know. Um, we're unlikely to get attacked from this direction. I've got a couple of fleets heading off this way. Two fleets here. Start with King of the Castle and win from there. That's very true, actually. Yeah, that's a good point. Yeah, was it was it you that was always all about the demon worship? I can't remember. It was something like that, wasn't it? Uh, let's make our quick response fleet a little bigger. I think. Oh wow, we can make we can make huge fleets now. Actually, let's just double check. We've upgraded everything uh, as far as it could be. I think we... That's all we've got. Yeah, blue lasers, plasma throwers, yeah. Sonic shields, more plasma throwers. Yeah, I think we've got on that front. Oh yes, Racket Master the Cockroach Queen. Yes, I'd forgotten about that. Not Ratama Hatter, which is a uh, song by Sepultura. That's very different. Uh, of which I will not do a rendition. Uh, can we get us to a healthy 2,000? Nice. That's only going to cost 700. Okay, yep, let's make the, uh... 
quick response force, uh, an actual decent concept. That sounds good. All right, super clanker. What's this? Oh, that's the caravan thing that they gave us. Okay, which was frankly a bit of arse, and apparently hasn't been reinforced. I don't know why that happens sometimes, honestly. Probably I was building something and got distracted by something else. That that probably makes sense. Also, that's terrible posture. I shouldn't lean back in my chair. I tell you, that's something else I need to think of at some point. New chip. Uh. Right, okay. We're good. We're good. It's quiet. I don't like it. I don't like it when it's quiet. Uh, renaming a fleet? Which fleet would you wish to rename? Sorry, I have a itchy nose. Reinforcements in transit. Cool. Anomaly detected. Oh, anomaly. Uh, the Junker, Ford Falcon. <laughs> okay, give me a sec. I shall, uh, I shall dig it out. Right, are you still surveying? Yep. Leave it for now. Right, fleet management. Uh, super clanker. Yeah, the fact you can, like, rename... Oh no, hang on, I have to find it in the actual universe, don't I? Uh, no, I can do it here. No, Super Clanker is the name of the fleet. The name of the ship. Ah, ship details. Here we go. Uh, oh, I can't rename it. Because it's not mine. I think. Uh, let me double check. Yeah, no, I can't. I don't think I can. I don't think I can. Uh... Oh, no, hang on. Hang on. I was clicking on the wrong part of the screen. Oh. There you go. It is now the Arse Ford Falcon. Actually, what does that actually have on it? Oh yeah, it just had a large, uh, just have a, a ridiculously large plasma cannon on it. Yeah, at the time, this was actually like light years ahead of what we had, which is kind of funny. But that that that's fine. This is fine. Impossible organism. Uh, ooh, okay. Retrieve samples of the unknown organism. Oh, I'm sure nothing bad will happen there. Oh, go on, sample it. What's the worst could happen? Log updated. One of these days, I really need to have a look at the uh, the, the log. That finishes in ten months. In fact, let's do that now. Uh, translating explorer's text, 10 months. Uh, that's the grabbing all the stuff. Oh, resume access? What's this one? Repentance time. It's archaeologi archaeological things. Cost 3,000, 10 months. Fuck it. Do it. Face hugger. Yeah, probably. Construction complete. Knowing my luck. Well, there's a, there's a debate. Facehugger or Tribbles? Well, that's a question. I think I prefer Tribbles. I think Tribbles would be, complete. like, less dangerous. <laughs> Probably more annoying, but less dangerous. A Twubble with Twibbles. Yeah, no one ever made an episode called The Trouble with Facehuggers, did they? Um... <laughs> yeah, that's that's what Norton do. Nor Norton does like to do that. Uh, should we... Well, actually, let's put him on automation, and then he can build all the things here. What are you doing? Oh, good, you're doing stuff. 
Yes, yeah, so I finally got my uh, construction, construction ships complete. on automated, so we're getting like a butt ton of resources now, which is good. Because I'm sure we're going to need them at some point. Oh, don't tell me that. Establishing colony. Oh, okay, cool. Colony established, we like. Uh, oh, what's going on in the Senate? Uh, it's in recess. Okay, cool. Establishing colony. Oh, it's spreading everywhere. Oh. Oh! Right. So. Uh. This is funny. The pacifist... Pacifist... Swolfin Empire has just declared war on the Melodic Hub. <laughs> is a butt ton more than an ass load? Uh, it depends if it's a metric butt ton or an imperial uh, butt ton. Uh, they are different. <laughs> wow. Are they still pacifists? Or have they changed their minds? They're still pacifists! I mean, it doesn't stop them fighting people, but... Yeah, honestly, I did wonder. I did wonder if it was the Swolfins that, that kicked off. Now, how's that gonna work? Because... Oh, okay, because the Melodic Colonies are actually their vassals. Okay, the Melodic Hub may well be going the way of the Dodo. Um... What is this? Neutral Fleet's Ghost Ship. I never understood what this was about. It's like some sort of critter, but it's it's a ghost ship. That's weird. So what happens is people petition the pacifists to be freed, and the pacifist rides into the rescue. Oh, I see. Right. So... Oh! Oh, I think I see what the AI, AI is doing. No, I don't, actually. Who would the Melodic Hub be... Oh, okay. Is it because of the Vassal State? I don't know. It's got to be something like that, hasn't it? How oh, very interesting. Yeah, they get quite bullshit, the old Swolfin Empire. They're, uh, they're, they're quite big. We're gonna do eek, eek, eek us to death. I mean, it, quite possibly. Survey complete. I mean, honestly, man, don't mess with dolphins. Yeah, doth. <laughs> yeah, this is, this is actually the, uh, great thing about, well, they're not great thing, it's a terrible thing. Um, dolphins are assholes. The whole thing about, like, uh, oh, yeah, dolphins, how wonderful, lovely creatures dolphins are. It's like, they're, they're dicks. They are dicks of the sea. They really are. They're, they are not very nice. They are dicks of the sea. Not like Aquaman. Anyway, um, oh, that's Uncombed System. Go grab it. Not all of you, just one of you. There you go. What are the rest of you doing? Building mining stations, that's fine. You looks like you're both building the same mining station. But that's fine. Uh, there's still these two systems I haven't uh, consolidated yet. Spaceborne life form encountered. Oh. Uh, a moke system? Uh, probably don't have enough influence for that. Wait, ah, stop! Ah! <laughs> Special project complete. Uh, hey, the Archaos. Better leave the ghost ships alone. Don't want a gene stealer infestation. Haha, <laughs> no. No, we don't. Though, the question would be, who would be the Inquisition? Because I think all of us are religious fanatic militarists, so... Maybe everyone is the Inquisition. Maybe no one is the Inquisition. Um... Also bees. I don't know. Okay, um... Oh, I vaguely remember this from last time round. We should continue to study it. Or oh, the alien is too dangerous. Shoot the life form into deep space. I mean, harsh. Let, let's keep studying it. Long it's fine. Updated. Why not? Uh, desiccated. Found signs of water all over this world. And it should be there. 
Oh, they got really thirsty. The walk work of water thieves. Where is this? Or Vale? Wait, I'm not even looking at this planet. How do I know about this site existing? I'm puzzled. I guess it's is it the is it the Dimian League sharing info with me? I guess it must be. It's me, man. I only work here. Now, if I nick this planet, will these guys be pissed at me? Because they don't seem interested in expanding. Oh god, what's happening now? Oh yeah, no, no about that one. Uh, Senate is now in session. All right, anything I haven't voted on. Collective waste management. Diplomatic away from economy plus forty percent worker pop output. Yes. Alloys from jobs, minerals from jobs. Yes. Only habitability minus five percent. It'll probably pass anyway. I bet you the one 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 I support, everyone else will hate. That sounds about right. Uh, I guess we can find out. Oh, and a uh, promotion. Right, what have you got? Okay, so you're flying a fleet at the moment. Okay, what have we got? Righteous Trickster. Emergency FTL damage risk minus 15... Combat disengagement chance plus 25%. Okay. So that makes them very good at running away. Unyielding is hull points, but not disengagement chance. We said this this was a bit of a liability, this one. Could just do aggressiveness too. Yeah, let's do that. Fuck okay. it. Uh, hey, Dodori. How's it going? I apologize if I mangled your username. New player here on which I asked, uh, which of these two mods are better? Real space or planetary diversity? Um, I am not using either of those. Um, however, we do have a fair few people in chat who can probably answer that question for you. I am not familiar um, with either of those two mods, so I really couldn't tell you. Um, I I mostly use cosmetic mods. This is this is only like my second run through of the game. Um, but, uh, yeah, I have absolutely no idea. <laughs> Hopefully somebody in chat will be able to answer your question. But, uh, welcome to the stream. I hope you're doing very well. Um, yeah, I'm using a mostly, mostly cosmetic mod list. Uh, and I, I think I've just got one very small gameplay tweak, but yeah, I'm... I think we looked at planetary diversity? Um, but I chose not to not to install it because i figured it was a complete. bit um it would change too many things but yeah I, I honestly could not tell you uh energy emissions right are you still surveying here it uh, looks like you might be e oh no it's unclaimed okay uh sure investigate then in that case do we have enough influence uh nearly Oh, this guy's bored. Right, well, let's find out if they're not going to like us building here. I'm not entirely sure. Yeah, so the uh, mod list I'm using is LCLS2. I've got to remember it. There we go. Uh, that's the list of mods I'm using at the moment. Um... The one thing I would warn is that the uh, color mod uh, does weird things to uh, Empire flags. We discovered that. Uh, we've actually got um, three uh, empires that are actually from chat. So we have Bamboozle Ballet has the Solidarity of Gorfus as a custom one. Uh, we have the Kiruin Empire, which is Roach Moguls. And we have the Swalford Empire, which is uh, Maths. Um, unfortunately, when I used the color mod, it changed all their flags, <laughs> which was... Not good. Uh, so, uh, but it's, it's, it's fine. <sighs> okay, eventually we're going to run out of unclaimed space and there's going to be a fight. Well, I mean, there's going to be more fights. Uh, I'm a modding freak. Uh, spend more time in the workshop than the game itself. 
Yeah, um, I went for a... I think I had like a couple of very small... I think I think the UI overhaul mod was the first one I used, and that was season one. Um, and yeah, these these are mostly. I think the only gameplay tweak is the um, mech armies. I think. But yeah, I gather there's an awful lot of uh, mods that you could throw at this, which I'm sure would have a weird and wonderful results. Uh, this particular asteroid is an extra solar capture. Oh yeah, totally. I was kind of like, uh, cause, cause it just, it, it scales the, uh, it scales the UI so much better. Uh, exotic radiation. Ooh. Oh, actually, that's not, that's not good at all. You don't want a rogue asteroid with exotic radiation. That sounds like a terrible idea. Uh, oh, physics research. Don't mind if we do. Uh, okay, good. Okay, it's getting it's getting space is getting a little bit full over here. Oh Jesus, I've only got eight influence. Okay, never mind. <laughs> Won't be claiming any more systems for a little while. Uh I wonder if I can actually reinforce my fleets a little bit. That might be an idea actually. Let's have a look at those again. Right, we've got the Artificer Fleet. Oh, that's 6.8 thousand. That's doing fine. Uh, Anvil Fleet. What have you got in there? Uh, frigates, Corvettes, couple of destroyers. Actually, let's look at the fleet management because that makes things much easier. Uh, let's round that out. Okay, Raiders we can't do anything about. Uh, let's check another handful of Corvettes, maybe. Plenty of plenty of alloys. A couple more frigates. A couple more destroyers. Yeah, that seems healthy. Um, stepped away. Anything crazy happen? Uh, not so much. We found a radioactive asteroid. Uh, which is always fun. Um, but that's about it. Uh, are you guys actually? Oh, okay, they are building stations. That's good. Uh, fleet order cancelled. This is fine. Everything is fine. Yeah, when this territory gets swallowed up, it's going to be like, oh no. Oh, wait, if I manage to cut off. Oh no, wait. Oh, I didn't think we could. I didn't think we could survey here. Apparently, we can. That's handy. Uh, yeah, I don't know if you can answer, uh... I, I, I'm apologizing if I'm mangling the username. Uh, is it Dadori? Dadori. Ask about uh, a couple of mods uh, saying which is better, real space Technology or planetary diversity. And I don't know what either of those do. Dado is good? Okay, that works for me. Uh, ooh, have we found another... No, that's still being surveyed. Uh, society. Okay, what we got? Population growth, heritage site, interstellar campaigns. Um, ancient. Ah, here we go. This is the thing I had no idea what this was. Ancient saturator artillery. X. That's a Titan weapon, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. There we go. Yeah, that's that's a that's a that's a fairly typical Roach Mogul moment. There, it's like I like both. <laughs> oh, there we go. Yeah, that that looks like a Titan weapon, which uh, I don't have Titans, so not not worth worrying about that right now. Um, that's a tile blocker one. Well, that's a, that'll be a short. That'll be a nice short one actually. Let's do a tile blocker. Sounds like a plan. Okay. I didn't think we could get here, but apparently we could. complete. Oh no, it's no. That's weird. I thought, yeah. Oh, we are taking over the universe. This is great. Okay. Well, they haven't yelled at us, so that's good. Uh, can we? Can Anomaly we? Oh, detected. hello. Uh. All right. Are you surveying? Are you researching? 
I think you're surveying. Yeah, you are surveying. Leave it be for now. Well, this calls your board. Oh no, you can build things. There we go. A special planetary origin with a continent's float? Oh, that sounds pretty cool. Yeah, we might go we might go wild in the Isles with season three. Uh we'll we'll, we'll see. We'll see how we get on with this one. Well, I think I've done a pretty good job of consolidating my empire so far. This is glorious. Uh, oh, not fully surveyed yet. Okay. Hot picks for mods when that time comes. <laughs> nice. Yeah, I think I think the latest patch, um, when they brought out the machine age, complete. It broke a few things. Um. But bless them, the modders, I think within 48 hours, most of the stuff that I was using got patched. And I was like, brilliant! Thank you very kind. Modders are the best. Tectonic activity makes all continents float, but on more than others. That, that's true. Uh, that's being reinforced. That's good. Uh, also, we've managed to avoid this whole thing of having random ships floating around where I've accidentally reinforced somebody and then complete. moved them. Uh, oh, wait, hang on. Uh, what's this? Oh! Interesting! That's very interesting. The Solidarity of Gorfis has just declared war on the Bin Penchan. Huh. That's mighty interesting the the solidarity of Gorfis has been quite quiet i wonder if this is like a defensive move because the pimpenshan are just taking over everything over here what is their fleet power like i wonder okay their fleet power is terrible and their fleet power is terrible so i mean i mean comparison to me um, because, uh, apparently I am terrifying. Form Galactic Council. Ooh! This did add even more complexity last time we did this, if I recall, but it could be fun. Uh, the visuals of space itself? Uh, yeah, I, I don't... Uh, I don't know off the top of my head. That's something else I didn't uh, tinker with. Need to browse with patience the workshop. Yeah. Now, of course, the thing is, if I'm not on the Galactic Council, that could be awkward. That's true. We do have a Discord. Um, I tend not to put it in the chat because uh, sometimes it gets botted. But if you look at the about page of uh, my Twitch page, um, my Discord is on there. I can't remember if the link actually still works. But a lot of the time, if I have, if I put the uh, the Discord link into to Twitch chat, we always get botted. Which is well, not botted. We get like random people turning up that are clearly bots because they have like uh, accounts made like yesterday or something daft. So I'm a little bit careful about where <laughs> where we fling that about. Should we support the Galactic Council? Why not? We might even be in charge of it. Why not? Should I am complete. the Senate. Uh, ooh, quantum energy states. That's good. That's good. Right, we've got physics. Uh, research alternatives, which is almost... Already researched. That's handy. Twitch and Discord can be bot infested. Yeah, they really can. I'm probably I'm probably gonna have to do another purge of um, uh, chat at some point because there's a there's a bot list you can look up, and it's it's kind of it's a bit of a never ending fight. But every so often it was. I remember I, a, a while back and I was like. Wow, I've got like, I had a great number of viewers in that last stream, and I looked and saw the amount of bots that were sat in my chat, and I was like, oh, that's a bit depressing. 
Oh, there we go. Should we go with encryption? I'm gonna go with encryption. That was something we stumbled onto very late last time. Right, so who's at war with who now? So the Bin Penchan. Oh my god. Right, the Bin Penchan are just like fighting everybody. Because reasons. Maybe everyone isn't egalitarian enough and they have decided they want to make them. Yeah, so bizarre. So in fact, the Aeg, the Aeg Aman Kingdom are the only people that are close to me in fleet power, which is, um, obviously I'm not counted the Fallen Empires because, of course, their stuff's insane. Galactic East is a conflict zone? Yeah. Yes, it is. I think that's a, that's an interesting... So not only have they been Penchan fighting everyone here, they're also fighting the Gorphis. Wait, did the Gorphis join their... Hold on. Did the Gorphis join their... Join their thing, or are they on their own? Party leader Spleg. Love it. He's got a little moustache. Um... Okay, so they're not actually part of... Great Gorf. Been Pensan War of Aggression. Hmm. Interesting. I mean, if I was a complete dick, I could start throwing my weight around a little bit, but I don't want to be attacked on, like, three different sides. That would be rather embarrassing. Oh, hello. The final days. I could just work on the star petal. Okay. Oh, so apparently they got smacked out of space by an asteroid. Well, that's awkward. Oh. Uh, you have leveled up. Wait, what have you got there? Uh, planet governor effects. Well, luckily you're not governing a planet, so that's good. Oh, hello. Uh, right, he's a veteran. Explorer? It's a bit late for that. Uh, Scholar. Astral Rifts? I don't even know what Astral Rifts are. Don't think we have that DLC, do we? Don't think we have Astral Rifts. Uh, Analyst, no, that's Sector Governor, or... That's Council. Um... I'm gonna go with Scholar? Uh, that, that's the old command, Roach Mogul. Uh, if you have a look at the bottom of the screen, it's uh, got the new one. Floop. Noises. No, no, no. <laughs> it's at the bottom of the screen. Got to run, leaving a follow. Oh, thank you very much, Dado. That's very kind. Thanks for dropping by. And uh, take care of yourself. Enjoy the rest of your day. Thank you very much for the follow. Uh, yeah, uh, it's a wow. We we uh, hilariously we're the only ones just not thinking. We, we think that war is a bad idea. Well, actually, the really funny thing is, if we were to declare war on the Terrasians, we would have to get all the way up here. I mean, that could be a fun thing to keep us... Oh. Terrassian Despoilers is no longer a valid rival for our empire. That's because they're terrible. That's probably why. There you go, you know that, Roach Michael. Uh, borders open. Why? What? Why have the fanatic militarist xenophobes opened their borders to us? I'm perplexed. Is this because I beat the brakes off them with the mercenaries? This is because I beat the brakes off them with the mercenaries, isn't it? That's a trap! 
Nah, their, their fleet is terrible. I wonder if we could get over there and give them a kicking. I mean, everyone else is at war. And they've only actually... Right, let me, let me double check this. So have we closed borders with the... Wait, what? Unsurveyed system, but lies within... Bin Penshan sovereignty space. How does that work? They just decided to steal it? I don't know. A bit random. Okay, so providing our borders are closed to the Ryogan coalition, the only way the Terrestrians can get in are up here. So if we went over there and tried to steamroll them, that could be quite funny. And let's face it, no one would be mad at us if we did. At least I don't think anyone would be mad at us if we did. Because they're fanatic militarist xenophobes, so they can't have many friends. Hmm. Build a defensive corridor? I kind of can't. Simply because uh, I didn't get this system in time. <laughs> I mean, I could attempt to buy this system from the Ryogan. I wonder if I could bribe them. I wonder if I could throw money at them until they gave it to me. And then I could... I, that, that would then definitely be... There's only two ways that they could get at me. I'm going to try that. Let's see what happens. I don't think they like me very much. They don't like me very much. <sighs> Strange, crazy space vampires with their giant teeth. Um, okay. Uh, yeah, they're not, they're not, they're not doing very well. Um, right. Trade deal. This should be funny. Um, transfer system. Thirteen. Let me, let me try and actually pronounce that. Real Hatter Shytine. We'll have a real Shytine. I don't know. Minus a thousand. I mean, that's fair. Uh, let's try and sweeten the pot here. Uh, no communications. No, don't don't care about that. No. Uh, what about some alien artifacts? Because I've got a lot of them kicking around. Uh, oh, I can't give them alien artifacts. That's rude. Red crystals. Energy credits? I don't know. Bless you. <laughs> right, what have we got an abundance of? Uh, I, I, I don't think they're going to go for this. No. That's, that's a negatory, Ghost Rider. I mean, there's an elegant solution to this. I could just smash these guys into the ground because I think I could probably manage it. <laughs> would that be evil? It would be a little bit evil. Um... Hmm... You absolutely should. <laughs> I mean, I don't think there's much they could do about it. I'll be brutally honest. And then that would then mean we could, like, uh, close off a few things. Yeah, we could do that. Claim all their systems first? Ah, okay. Yeah, no, I didn't. I don't remember doing that um, before. How do we do that? Is it, um... No, legit. How do we do claims? I've forgotten. Get your claims in first because they're very expensive once you go to war. Oh, okay. So is it... Was it? What is it? Is it... Right, right, right. No, not here. Is it diplomacy? I haven't done this before. How do I do it? Actually, I might have probably moved some... You forget. <laughs> Is it somewhere... Is it diplomacy? You press the claims button. Oh, yeah, there you go. Claims. 
Uh, make claims. No claims. Uh, oh, claims mode. Claim system. Right. One. Oh, that gives me influence? Oh, nice. Okay. Um, oh my god, I have not... Oh, wait, no, these are my own systems. Okay, right. Oh, it costs influence to claim. Oh, shit. Well, we're not going to be able to claim all their planets, then. I've only got 122 influence. It's going to be a problem. That's... That's going to be an issue. That's... That's it. That's, that's, I can claim two systems. That, that is all I can do. It's like I said, I don't, I, I'm, I'm not sure Rust will be cheaper if you claim the one linking them first. Oh, oh, okay. So there and there. Okay. Uh, wait, hold on. 60, 80. Yeah, that's 100, so I can still, I can only do two. Uh, whichever way around I do it, it's only two. Uh, because that's all the influence I have due to being humiliated at some point in the past. Um, yeah, I suppose that would be one way to do it, and then our, our territory would board theirs. That would be quite funny. Yeah, yeah, well, either way, I'm not gonna have, I'm not gonna have enough, um, I'm not gonna have enough influence. It only works that way with claiming construction ships. Yeah, it's, it's like, I, I'm not gonna have enough influence to do that. They only have one planet. They only actually have two planets. That's quite funny. Oh, alright, two planets and a station, I think. So, what, wait until my Im I can use all my influence to claim the systems? Okay. Uh, right, how is our spying going? Because... I wanted to see what the Melodic Hub's deal was. Oh, we're never going to find out. Oh no, here we go. Gather information. Gain intel. That's going to take that's going to take forever. Uh, I mean we can try it. I mean, they're busy right now. They're, be they're busy being beaten up by the dolphins, so... I don't think they're going to have that much of an issue. Um, Overwhelming force. Don't mind if I do. Wow, we are, like... Other than one empire, we have the most, like, ship... ass-kicking capability. Um... The highest chip ass kicking game Technology ability discovered. out of the entire thing, which is quite funny. Uh, tile blockers, yep, sure. Oh, hello. Apprehended, ah, uh, told ya. Told ya. Apprehended by hunter seeker drones. We lack sufficient intelligence in the local area and our operators have earned the attention of the local. Uh, oh dear. Requires speedy. The event, a diplomatic solution happens in four days. That's quite funny. Galaxy probably views you as a sleeping giant? Possibly. Right. Export re- Oh! Exploit resource Zro. Do we have Zro? I think we have like a tiny amount of Zro. Oh no, uh, we've actually got- well, there's two Zro. Sleepy giant. Yeah, usually at the end of the stream I'm a sleepy giant. It's true. Should, should we do the, the, the Zro? Mindcrack. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> that would take fucking forever, though. That's gonna take some time. Um... Leader lifespan plus 10 years? I mean, that's not a bad one. Or do we go for the mind crack? That's gonna, that's gonna tie up our research for quite some time. Yeah, I feel that's a, a down the road idea, that one, to be honest. Mind crack. Um... What else is a good option here? That's gonna take forever. That's gonna take forever. I mean, leader lifespan isn't gonna actually take... That's gonna take a while. At least I have an immediate use for that. Hydroponics? Probably not gonna use those. I can go with lifespan, because that's about the only one I think I can see utility for. I think also having that... Um... Oh, here we go. Spymaster smoothed over our operative's awkward intrusion into the melodic hub. Cool! That was fine. That was fine. Everything's fine. Nothing happened. So where does that leave us? Uh, probably the broadside of fucked, I imagine. Yeah, it did say it was incredibly, incredibly difficult. Okay, maybe I need to wait for the uh, intel to build up a bit. Or is that still going? Oh, it's still going. Okay. Minus three. <laughs> Drake Roach Crusher must live longer. Oh, hello. Neil Degrassi Atom Crusher. All right, what's he got? He's got perfectionist, uh, leader experience, and lifespan. So, oh, literally all of these are upgrades. Twenty years experience gain or normally discover. I mean, let's do experience gain. That sounds like a good plan. Ah, uh, we could build even more ships. I'm waiting for those cruisers to rock up, but I think we could we could at least we could build like another fleet. I think. Uh. All right, that's our seven grand fleet. That's quite gross. Uh, we should probably put that somewhere, just in case we decide to. Actually, do you know what? Hmm. <clears throat> Actually, I don't know. I don't think these guys. The only real danger down here is the melodic hub, really, and they're not that scary. Uh, do I have another station here? I do. Right, I'm going to send a big fleet over there. And then I'm going to build another one! Because I can. Uh... Oh, also I forgot, yeah, you can copy them. That's actually quite useful. Uh, let's have a middling sized one. How about that one? Cruisers with hangars for strike craft. Yeah, we haven't built the cruisers yet. Um, erp, erp, erp. Cruisers are 34 months away. I think I could quite easily build another fleet and build some cruisers while I'm at it later. Um, that is not a problem. Right, what is our smallest one? Super clanker. Right. That'll give us... Obviously it won't give us that because that was free. Uh, I'm now looking at this, anything under 3,000 power is a bit small, which is kind of funny. Actually, having a second uh, quick response fleet wouldn't be a bad idea, would it? Oh, which has nothing in it. Okay, uh, reinforce 3,000. Yeah, we can afford that. I was about to say, I can't rename the fleet yet because it doesn't exist. Oh. A Zapian Raiders withdraw. That actually took less time. I don't think there's much left of the Tarassian despoilers to actually beat up. Um, which would explain why that didn't take very long. <laughs> oh no. Uh, yep, that's in transit. That's good. Wait, hang on. One of our fleets in transit reinforcing the other. Huh? Uh, well, now I'm confused. Oh, that's the new one. 
Okay, the Ironbound fleet is the new one. Okay, right, I see. Oh, wow, okay, yeah, we can build corvettes pretty bloody fast now. We really can build corvettes pretty Colony bloody fast now. Founded. This is good. Okay. Oh! I just realized we actually founded, like, three colonies, and I haven't actually done anything to them. I should probably do that. that that's a thing I should do. Traveling units for reserve defense, turd. <laughs> thank you. Thank you for that, Roach Merkel. Thank you. A very kind. Um... I'm gonna let this ride. I wanna see what they come up with. Um... Because that's just a bit of a waste of unity. Also, we haven't actually got an awful lot of unity at the moment, so sure. Let us see what democracy brings! Right, uh... Right, have you actually colonized or not? Oh, okay, you have colonized. Okay, right. Um... Cest k k k k prime Okay. Uh, blockers. Can we clear any of those? Yes, we can. That's good. Um, what else we got? How many minerals have I got? Not a huge amount. Um, let's do auto chthon monument because that's always a fun one. How much is it gonna cost us? Five hundred. Okay, we are not gonna be building too many of those um because i probably haven't built enough mines by the looks of it what's that uh as this weather none of which bother the cerulians who are now living here so that's always funny Wait, is that already got a, that's already got unemployment despite the fact that it's literally just complete. been founded. And another one! Of which I also probably can't afford to upgrade. No, I really can't. Erk. Erk. Have I overstretched myself? That's the question. I don't know. We have infinitely less less uh, planets than we had last time. I think this feels like a decent amount of habitable planets. Also, the fact it's it's made different by the fact that um, we we've had like the migration treaties, which means planets that we couldn't normally take, we've taken, which is quite handy. Uh, Civil War mod and the Rogue Colony mod, where they can literally USA or Britain. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah, that sounds uh, kind of nuts. We've decided to rebel! Oh god, that would just be another set of variables, wouldn't it? Oh my god. Be, be honest, Roach Mogul, do you honestly think my brain could handle that on another layer of var variables, like, on top of that? I'm... I, I'd worry for my sanity at that point. Wait, are you just sitting there not surveying that planet? Oh no, you are surveying it, okay. Yes? Hmm. <laughs> I will have to do some research. Wow, these guys are, like, leveling up really quick. Uh, Emperor Hedgehog Statin. Right, what's he do? Ship build speed, council agenda speed. Okay, delegate. Uh, ooh. Interesting. Uh, industrialist, no. Trust growth. Trust me, I'm a hedgehog. Okay, let's go with that. Sounds interesting. That was a weird noise. Boop. Taking over the galaxy. Uh. Okay, the Dimian League appear to have actually built some ships. This Lock is, uh. This is quite handy. Oh god. Oh god, it's all happening. The Heart of the Pulsar. Rummaging through the secure safe with... Da, da, da. Strange artifacts and jewellery. Most noteworthy among them is the Heart of the Pulsar. A unique diamond necklace. Five different heads of state. Oh, hello. 60 artifacts, which will disappear because my artifact storage is full. 4,000 energy. Nice. 
Ancient Rampart. Tech progress gained Ancient Rampart. Mm. Sounds fun. Silently awaits Hamster's take on dealing with revolutions. <laughs> oh, who... Oh, look at that roach... Cro roach... Look at that roach mogul. You got voted back in for a second term. What is going on? You were... You, you were gonna... You were gonna... No, wait. Is that the same one? Hang on, I'm confused. Where's my government? Is that the same one? I, I'm not sure. I think it is. Good lord. Drake, yes. Was he already in charge? I, I can't remember. I think he was. Let's see the Zathians. Yeah, we, we could just, like, with a proper bit of manoeuvring, we could just smash our way clean through there. Without an awful lot of resistance. Oh, what's going on here? Uh, anything I haven't already voted on. Yep, once again, the universe is after us. Um, actually, why wouldn't I vote for diplomatic weight from economy? Oh, I voted against this because it ups my priest upkeep. Okay. Isn't everyone religious, though? Why would they want to... They, they just want to fuck with me, don't they? That's what I'm guessing. How can you say no to a leader telling you to shag all day? It's true. It's a fair point. It's a fair point. I don't want to work. I'm going to shag all day. Okay, yeah. Um... Why are my things complaining? Uh, yes, you have no, you have no jobs because you literally have no buildings. That's why. Oh my word! Uh, oh, gas giant signal. Pockets of radiation in the gas giant's atmosphere. Intense orbital bombardment. Oh dear. What someone could hope to gain from bombing a gas giant? I mean, yeah, sounds like a bit of a frustrated thing. Praise the Emperor and pass the nuclear missiles. Actually, do you know what? Nuclear missiles are actually passe for us at the moment. Hate that event, it's not bad, just annoying. Oh, okay. We should investigate, isolate signal, we should ignore it. Well, I'm gonna investigate. Log updated. Log updated. Uh, oh wait, hold on. Uh, wait, what is that? Oh, timed project. Uh, yeah, sure. I mean, you're there. Why not? What's the worst that could happen? Everyone explodes. Oh, interesting. Oh, well, well, what have we got going on here? Uh. Oh my god, okay. The Aeg Aman fleet is 19,000. That's a bit spooky. I wonder, if, is that like their entire military power in one fleet? I think it might be, you know. That's quite terrifying. Oh, is that the Kiryu in, in, in there as well? Okay, this looks like a- this looks, this might be a three-way dance going on here. I don't know what the hell's happening here. Blocker cleared. Oh, I think somebody just melted. Oh no, wait, these are allied. Are these allied? I think they're allied. They're not fighting each other. Blocker cleared. Oh, okay, they're beating the- Survey complete. They're beating the brakes off the Vin Penchan. Oh, I see. I see, I see. So there you go, your, your, guys, your guys are getting stuck in in galactic events, Roach Mogul, just not quite in the way that you thought. They, they are now part of a... a, a three-tier invasion fleet. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Who are now whooping the Bin Pinchan into tiny pieces. Ah. Right, massive and extremely violent storm systems in the atmosphere. Okay... Interesting. 
Oh, what's going on here? Research agreement proposal, the Dimian League and the Swalford Empire. Okay. Available. Oh god, what if we end up being allied with the Swalford Empire? That's gonna be that's gonna be messy. There's gonna be a lot of backstabbing at some point, I feel. I'm just not entirely sure from who. Also, weren't the Swalfins attempting to be Oh, they the oh. Well, Math, uh you've literally beat the brakes off the melodic hub. Um they're 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 a little upset. Though you haven't actually occupied any of their things. Yeah, yeah, it's a bad day to be a toaster, apparently. Uh, system surveyed. The thing about backstabbing is it's better to be you to it first. Yeah, get get your retaliation in first, yeah. Um, do I have a spare? Okay, I feel that system is probably more important than these two, maybe? Uh, oh wait, I can do both. Um, let's grab that one anyway, fuck it. This is mine. This is mine. All this is mine. Except that bit. That bit ain't mine. Construction complete. I am worried about how well this is going. No one's no one's tried to punch me in the face. I've got a massive fleet. Uh my tech is doing pretty good. I accidentally on purpose uh employed uh a buffer state over here. Uh, I'm waiting for the other shoe to happen. The other shoe to happen? The other shoe to drop. Wait for the other shoe to happen. Wait, what is my dude doing up here? What are you doing? Oh, you're surveying. I mean, that's fair. That is what I told you to do. But I, I, why would I want any planets over here? That would be a daft idea. Um, I think I need to redirect you. Um... How about, for example, um... Oh, wow, you took the long way, didn't you? Holy shit. Uh, there's plenty to do over here, so come back. Uh, where's the anomaly? I've just lost it. Oh, there it is. Don't know. I'm too fool. Don't jinx it! <laughs> yeah. I think we've had a, a, a... I've got to double check. Where was... Right. Uh, yeah. This this lady who has all the legendary stuff, she has given us such a massive boost in research. I think that's what's clinched it. So she's got... Uh, research speed for industry is plus 10%. Computing is 10%. Uh, happiness plus 7%. Research speed overall plus six percent. Life matter yeah, she she is she has been a bit broken. Uh resolutions passed. Technology I can discovered. Do about that. Oh, technology Initiating communications. Oh, hello. Encryption. Alright, give me new new things. Uh what have we got here? Colony development speed, bit late for that one. Uh, research station output plus 10%. Sounds good. Uh, establish embassy. The Shirtishian Covenant. Uh, wishes to establish an embassy. Sure. Why not? They're these tiny little people down here. Still have tier 1 shields? I do not have tier 1 shields. We've got size shields. Due to a slightly weird event we had, yeah, we've got we've got we got side shields. <laughs> we we are okay in the shield department. Yeah, <laughs> it is not a problem. Yeah, I didn't take improved deflectors because they didn't look better than the side shields. I felt that was a little redundant. Yes, I have a I I have my own navigators now. Who are like hamburger cheeseburger big mac whopper and it just keeps the it keeps the shields up. That's that's all you hear. 
Uh, not yet. Uh, where's our thingamajig? Uh, we've nearly finished Supremacy. Uh, I think Psionics might be the next one. Uh, which could be quite funny. Oh, special project completed. Special project complete. Thank you, game. I just said that. Uh, managed to isolate the weak signal that was coming from somewhere deep inside the atmosphere. Okay. On the screen. Oh, here we go. Okay, what the heck is this? Uh, we are the Dathnag. And the planet you're orbiting is Tolok Rong, our ancestral home. Okay. It's always riveting to meet a solid. <laughs> Do me a solid. It's dying and we will perish unless we find a new home. We've identified a planet that would suit us physiology. No means to get there. <sighs> hmm. Uh, if you have no technology, how are we speaking? Oh, someone left them a mobile phone. Okay. What happened to your planet? They wanted us to embrace their religion. We refused, and this triggered some kind of genocidal reaction. Uh, not, not much has changed, to be honest. So, you want us to transport your entire species to another planet. I mean... Where is this? Y Yanak? I don't know where Yanak is. Yarak. Uh, where the fuck was... Where the hell would that be? I don't know where this is. It's probably out in the booties. Oh, it's within my borders? Oh, okay. Well, let's help them then. Why not? It does sound a bit suspect, doesn't it? Yeah. Oh, that didn't work. Why didn't that work? Oh. Oh, no, wait. I didn't uh, help you relocate. There we go. Long updated. Not to let your colonists claim this alluring world before we get there, no matter how strong the temptation. What if that's happened already? What if that has already happened? Where the hell is this? Oh, okay. It is, it is in my... Uh, well, I don't know where they want to go, though. That's the funny thing. Uh, Do I have a spare science vessel? As it turns out, I do. They're gas people? Oh, okay. Um, I think this guy's the closest dude we've got, I think. Yeah, okay. Excellent, yes. Fart people. Fart people. Fart people. I guess it's like we broke somebody's encryption or something wacky? I don't know. The Fart Fellowship. Pop, 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 pop. Yes. Um, that's a noise I just made. Okay. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm waiting for something to go wrong. Legit waiting for something bad to happen. It's 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 gotta happen at some point. I think we got very lucky with our placement that we weren't surrounded being surrounded by angry people. That that seems to have worked out Council for us. Agenda ready. Uh wait. Oh no, it's, again, Terrassian to spoilers, that's a uh Science ship. Council Jedi ready. Military build up! I mean, why not? Ow. Alright, what's next? You did get lucky this season. It does feel like it. it. It does feel like it. Got lucky last season too? Oh, there you go. 
Uh, what do we do here? Favored society. Evolving society. I mean, unity is always good. Yeah, I mean, we've been nice to everyone. We've we've built up a, you know, couple of massive death fleets. Um, hired some mercenaries. Everything's everything's fine, really. Oh, don't you dare! Don't you dare! No melodic help. You got there too soon. You got it too late. Even that planet is mine. This planet is ours. No, this planet is theirs. Construction complete. Like so. Yoink! Yep, exactly. And I've just catapulted his, uh, catapulted his, um, <laughs> his dude into the ether, which is, uh, oops. Um, I mean, we could go for this one next. I mean, why the hell not? Suriel? Go grab. Grab and yoink. Drake finally gets to throw the, em the, weight, the empire around. We, we are a pretty weighty empire, it has to be said. Um, Do we grab that one, or do we start researching stuff? Oh, he's buggering off over there. Why is he buggering off over there? I don't know, there's plenty to do here. Start, start doing stuff here, that might be useful. Is that another planet I could nobble? Okay, should I be nobbling all these planets? I don't know. Uh, an ocean world. Weak magnetic field. Atmos- Oh, well that's fucking funny. Atmospheric ar aphrodisiac. Uh, habitability plus 5%. Population growth speed plus 10%. Governing ethics attraction minus 20%. They just want to get jiggy. They don't want to listen to the government. Uh, that's kind of funny. Fuck it, we're having it. Oh god, we've got Cetitians now! Oh my god, I don't know how we ended up with Cetitians. We did an embassy, but we didn't do a migration thing. Oh, I don't know. Uh, rename the... star you yoinked to... Yoink. Okay. <laughs> Uh, it was this one, wasn't it? There we go. Oh, there's a raid! Hey, Thrifty Tokens, how's it going? Welcome, welcome. Hope you're doing well. Eradicate the wall. <laughs> We're, we're doing pretty good on that front, actually. We're, we're doing okay on the uh, eradication levels. Uh, we're actually quite peaceful. Uh, what, what's happened is everyone's left us alone. Uh, and we've built up a massive amount of uh, uh, fleet power. And not an awful lot of people can actually deal with us now. Which is kind of funny. I've been very polite, but there we go. But welcome in, Raiders. I hope you're doing very well. Um, and thank you very much, Thrifty Tokens, for the raid. I haven't played this in a while. This is only my second uh, run through. Um, uh, thank you very much for the follow, uh, Venting Couch. Thank you, thank you. Um, this is only my second playthrough, so I, I I know a little bit more of what I'm doing. But yeah, if you look at everyone's like uh, fleet strength and stuff, I'm I'm kind of I'm a little bit over overpowered. <laughs> Other than this lot. Th this lot are my nearest rival, I think. But, uh, yeah. Have you obtained the Galactic Center? I'm kind of hugging the Galactic Center, to be honest. Um, and the only reason other people have got close to where I am is that the, the peaceful toasters are running away from the angry dolphins. Uh, the crazy fox rock bug alliance is just... This is just a mess over here. And, um, I made friends with these people, so I wouldn't have someone behind me, so I'm, I'm kind of like, it's just a mess. The strong dolphins, yeah. Don't judge you with my 1.7 thousand hours in the game, that's fine! 
<laughs> That's fine. I, it, it honestly depends which day you catch me. It was like, I think last Wednesday. Um, wait, what day is it today? It is Wednesday. Last Wednesday, I was a bit out of it. Or maybe it was a Saturday. Can't remember. That's how out of it was. Can't remember what day it was. Um, but today's gone gone well. I, I learned to use judicious use of the, the uh, uh, pause button. So my brain no melty. Um, but yes, we do actually have three custom uh, empires. Uh, we have the Solidarity of Gorfis, which was made by uh, one of our viewers, Bamboozle Ballet. We have the Kiruin Empire, which is made by Roach Mogul, and we have the Swalfin Empire, which is made by Math. Um, Roach Mogul's not very happy because the Kiruin Empire has been subsumed by the Egg Aman Enlightened Kingdom and all their dudes, and they're just being used to the tip of the spear at the moment, so he's, he's not too chuffed about that. that. But uh, yeah, it's, it's quite angry, this side, where on this side it's quite peaceful. Because I think anyone, if anyone steps up to me, I could just punch them in the nose. Pauses for the week. No, pause is necessary. Trust me on this one. Did we send someone over here to sort this out? I thought we did, didn't we? Is he going to get there in time? Oh, he's going to get there in time. Thank God for that. Also, when can I join? <laughs> no, this is a single player. Yeah, we're, we're not actually... This isn't a multiplayer... Um set up we we were uh, the, the the idea of multiplayer was chucked around um but i think i just get absolutely smooshed by that technology but discovered you never know one day in the future maybe if you don't need pause you're not pushing yourself <laughs> pause for clarity yes i i need a lot of clarity it's very true <gasps> cruisers yes here we go this is what i was saving my alloys for <laughs> oh Armored torpedoes. Oh, hello. Armored torpedoes. The scheduling would be mad to keep on top of. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Uh, in fact, I used to play. I think I played like. Uh, was it one speed higher than this or two speed higher than this? And I've dropped it down to where it is now, and it's just it's much better. Plasma thruster. That's fun. But let's face it, armored torpedoes. Come on. You get spanked so hard, I don't know how to hold back in this game. Yeah, exactly. I would I would get I would get crushed. Yeah, I think more DAC is always a good idea. Right, we get to design a cruiser now. <laughs> okay, what have we got? Uh now. What have we got for Okay, so we've got artillery bow. Large uh, M4, S, G. Okay, so small torpedoes, broadside bow. Hmm. Well, at the moment, we had... Well, we had... We did have the frigate was double missiles, but then the, there aren't any good small missiles anymore, so I just put... It's called space torpedoes on it. I mean, technically, all torpedoes are space torpedoes if you put them in space, but, you know. Right, so what should we do here? Artillery bow, torpedo bow, broadside bow. Hmm. I like the idea of a torpedo bow. That could be fun. All for swarm rockets. <laughs> I, think, I think somebody swore me off swarm rockets the other day. I don't think we've actually res re uh, uh, researched them, to be honest. Broadside bow. Okay, what do we reckon? I'm I'm actually leaning to it. Wait, torpedo bow. So we got big boom on the front, medium boom in the middle, medium boom, medium boom in the middle. So what are our options here? Uh, utility slots or weapon? Oh no, that's that's like no broadside's fine. Uh, hmm. Torpedoes were anti-capital weapons. I think torpedoes are anti anything weapon, I think. Oh, deals additional multiplicative, that's a word, damage based on 100% of the target ship's size. Okay, so the bigger they are, the more damage it does. Okay. Reading. Reading is important. Um. Hmm. Alright, 
Just gonna just gonna workshop this for a sec. Alright, and then we have uh oh it's worth one out. Yeah, we've got sonic barriers as well, which is kind of funny. Uh right, the crystal infused plating is not as good as ceramic metal, so let's stick that in there. Whoops, I just accidentally replaced the wrong thing. Sounds about right. Alright, still got like 226 power left after that. It's a shame I haven't got anything that, but this bigger shootiness. I can play support for Hamster since everyone else wants to be a bully. <laughs> what well, one day, one day we might, might we might try a multiplayer thing. I don't know. We'll, we'll I'll have a think about it. I feel that would be a smidge overwhelming for yours truly. Oh wow, we got auxiliary fire control. Ooh. That makes it shoot better. Chance to hit plus five. Okay, and... I'm gonna give it afterburners, because evasion is fun. We've still got 206 power left over. <laughs> oh my god. That's uh, kind of wackadoodle. 46 damage. Most, most of it from plasma. Evasion's 14%. That's actually... Oh, wow. Uh, so, plus three thrusters, plus ten cruiser, five percent afterburners, and four percent excess power. <laughs> That's a bit... Hmm. Just, just, DM me if multiplayer happens till September. <laughs> I shall, I shall bear it in mind. I shall bear it in mind. Uh, yeah, this, this looks good, I guess. Or should we put, like, a bunch of nuclear missiles on the front? I mean, no, because plasma does more. I mean, the only other option we've either got we got torpedo, we got plasma, or we have nuclear missile. Why don't I just fill the front with missiles? Plasma all day, yeah. I like having a, I like having one torpedo on the front though. Okay, right. What are we gonna call it? Um. So where are we going? We went for Spike, Hedgehorn, Hedgethorn, Pike. Oh man, what are we gonna do? Plasmaris for the week. It's the most powerful thing I've got at the moment. Um What were the other options for the middle, actually? Oh wait, we can fit a uh, artillery core? Oh Oh wait, we can put torpedoes in the middle. Oh, hang on, hang on. Oh, okay, that's only one slot. Okay, okay. Uh, oh, those are utility slots. Duh. No, I think my previous idea was better. What size is this? Two things, two smalls, or utility. But steady on, steady on, venting couch, good lord. Uh, oh, that's got me thinking now. I got confused between weapon slots M and utility slots M there, that was quite embarrassing. A torpedo call. No, that's a shit idea. No, that's, 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 no, no. I think I preferred. The well, actually, hang on. Oh yeah, no, no, no. I preferred all the mediums. Back to plan A. Oops, that doesn't go there. Plan A was better. Albia class. That's not a bad one. Uh, so what was it? Sonic, 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 Sonic. Armor, 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 armor. Right, uh, yeah, cool, okay. Owl, beard, glass, cruiser. Nice! Uh, how much does one of these cost, though? It's probably gonna cost a small fortune. That's what I was saving up my alloys for. Right. 
Let's have a quick look at the uh, fleet manager. Right, how much does one of these cost? Holy shit. 607 on its own. <laughs> Uh, anyway, lurk time. Thank you very much for the lurk. Time for the personal purge in Anno. No problem. Thank you very much uh, for the follow, and uh, catch you later, Vending Couch. Game is so comfy and cozy after you know how it's played. I, I honestly, I'm. I think I'm beginning to get the hang of like the like like the basics, like the fleet management stuff. That is way more uh, clear this time around. Um, I was struggling with it a bit last time because um, I, I kept forgetting to hit the reinforce button, which is kind of funny. Uh, so hang on, two of these would be 1,200. That's a lot. Okay, these are quite spicy. I mean, we could just stick... Can we just stick a cruiser in each one? Is that... is that mad? It doesn't feel mad. Oh, wait! Fuck! I forgot to do ah hold on, I forgot to delete the old one. Booger Halbeard, yeah that's right. Okay. Yeah, no, I I need to I need to delete the old one. Cause there's not much point. Filling up your no, not that one, that's the quick response fleet. Uh as is that one. We need 200 hours to learn the basics. <laughs> yeah, I, I feel I came in at a, 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 a decent kind of time where a, a lot of the game had kind of developed. Um, we did have a couple of comedy moments where some people said, do this thing, and, I was, and, and people were like, when was the last time you played it? They're like, 2017! It's like, a lot has changed. <laughs> I'm like, well, I've played it never, so I've got no idea what's going on. But uh, that was uh, that was season one. Se season one was kind of a bimble. This is this is still quite a bimble, but it's a relatively organized bimble ish. But I honestly think we've kind of been we've kind of been blessed with the start we got, to be honest. Who's that? Oh, that's the Raiders. Okay. Uh oh yes, Galactic Domination. How's that going on for us? Uh did I colonize? I think I did, didn't I? Yep, thought so. Uh set to recess. Oh, tied to the Solus. Uh no. No. Wish wish to oppose. Thank you. Hey Ravot, how's it going? I have one thousand hours in this game and I still learn new things. There's all I, I think I think the uh the, the buzzword I started using for this towards the end of season one. I think uh there's always another menu. That's that that became my watchword. It was kinda like Someone would someone would turn up as like, hey, we looked at so and so, and it'd be like, boop, boop, boop. There's another menu. Oh god. <laughs> yeah, it, it it kind of became that. Uh oh, the uh Bin Penshan has offered peace to the Egg Aman. Okay, there's a good reason for that because oh Roach Mogul, you poor poor guy. Your 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 empire is literally being used as the tip of the spear. You, you are literally, they are using you as, as a proxy to bully other people. It's kind of, um... Oh, hold on. Have they subbed... Wait, 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 wait. The Binpenshan sovereignty is forced to adopt the ethos and government form of Aeg Aman Enlightened Kingdom. Reverend Elder Glim Stelfrost is... Did they just take them over? Oh, shit. Uh, that's not good. Uh, also, it looks like you've got your empire back. Well, that's an unexpected turn of events. Uh, yeah, look at that, you've got your empire back. Okay, so what happened there is that the Aeg Aman beat the brakes off the Bin Penshan... And I think they just forced them into becoming their vassal state. Oh no, they're independent. Hang on. Oh god. That that could be this could be very bad. 
Uh... Okay, there's still a war with Gorfis, but I don't think... No, I think they are actually... No, they're still independent, but they basically said you're going to have to... T uh, oh. Oh no, Xenophile, that's fine. Oh god. Yeah, they did change... Was that their... It was it their ethics? Oh, hang on a minute. Let's get this project on. complete. Okay, the psionic mouse has managed to relocation of Deathnack to their hue the hue home. Cool. Hail them. Hello. We are forever in your debt. This planet has exceeded our expectations. Baldurak, after your species, even though my species is not called Baldurak. I was gonna say Baldurak? We are Hedgeites. Really? I could have sworn. Apologies, we can different to tell you solids apart. It's got a nice ring to it, though. Uh, have fun with your new home. Sure. Crazy people. Okay, so how have the Bin Penshan changed here? The Phonetic Spirist Xenophile. So is that the same as the... Oh, they have. Yeah. They are now fanatic spiritualist xenophiles. Oh, that's funny. I mean, at least they like us. Okay, that's that's a worry. Okay, so yeah, after all that, Roach Mogul, uh, you've literally got your empire back because your overlord said, "Get the fuck out." <laughs> your overlord literally said, "Get off my lawn." Off my vassal state, and uh, your empire is back to being pretty much the size it started with. So, uh, congrats! <laughs> oh, this is this is eventually going to just fold in on itself in a fucking disaster. I can I can feel it. Okay, it is quarter past eight, so uh, I tacked on a little bit more time because I had a slightly extended break. But uh, uh, peace through. Backer. There we go. Let's save that. Make sure that's saved. Which it has. Okay, let's get out of here. Do, 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 do. Okay, let's go to the ending screen. There we go. Thank you all very much for being part of the stream. It is much appreciated. I have to remember to look up there. Hello. Uh, thank you, Venting Couch and Dado for the follow. Thank you, uh, Thrifty Tokens for the raid. It is much, much appreciated. Um, you can find all my assorted links like YouTube, Twitter, socials, Discord, things like that in that page, which has all the links, which is glorious. Uh, thank you for the hydrate, Matthew. Yeah, it's a bit required, actually. Hang on. Uh -huh. And as you can see on the screen in front of you, I will be back with some more Stellaris on Saturday. So join us for more than that. I, I hope I was I was uh, I'm going to be uh, on the ball like I was today because I felt like I was relatively with it today. So this is good. Um, but yeah, keep yourself posted. Occasionally I do do spontaneous. Occasionally I do do. Occasionally I do spontaneous streams on a Thursday and Friday. Uh, you'll get notified in the Discord if I do. See how I feel. See how brain melty goes. Um, but yes, thank you all very much. So, oh yes, I need to mention the charity I'm supporting, which is Stack Up, which is here, which I forgot to do again, dear oh dear. Uh, they use the power of video games and nerdy stuff to help out uh, active servicemen and veterans, so please have a look. Um, also the Vatican City State is banned from playing Helldivers. <laughs> that's random, or well, that's specific, one of the two, yeah. Um, but yes, uh, well, let's go find somebody to raid before my brain melts, uh, because that's a good idea. So, uh, yeah, thank you all very much. It has been quite a productive stream, dear God. We've had a lot going on. Hell divers. Oh, God, yeah, that's that's just so dumb. Funny, funny, but dumb. Uh, okay, who have we got? God, uh, what is it? Wednesday, okay. Hmm. Oh, the PSN account thingy? Okay, yeah. Uh, let's go raid... Uh, let's just double check my, my screen thing is showing correctly. Yeah, it is. 
Let's go read HBFT Gaming. He is a lovely chap. He is doing some uh, XCOM at the moment. Let me grab his channel link. Wedge that in the chat. Glorious. And uh, yes, please be kind when you raid. Take care of yourselves. And uh, I will see you on Saturday. So, bye-bye.